And we're live! Hello, everybody! Welcome, welcome! Glad to have you all back! Happy Thursday! It's a Thursday! Haringa dinga Thursday! <laughs> we're here! We're back! We're not exactly where we left off from yesterday, but pretty darn close. Um, so strap in, because we're doing some more alt cleanup! <laughs> ATT! Bags, all that stuff. Fun, right? But hey, it needs to be done. We need to register them to my bag gown, to ATT, make sure the warband actually picks them up since it wasn't reading some of them yesterday. Yeah! Exciting! So here we go! Organization time! Woo! So, so thrilled. <laughs> uh, but hello, Stormbound, Tana, Bella, Short, Bust, Ruse, In, Witch, Hobbit, and Arendt. How you doing? Hey, long time no see. Finally able to catch a stream again. Yes! Welcome back, Storm. Glad to see you here again. Hope things have been going alright for you. Welcome back, Arena. Two streams in a row. I'm able to catch. Yes! Glad to hear it, Tanabella. Sounds like a good time. I'll know it's a good time because it's here with me. <laughs> uh, yeah. So kick back, relax, grab a drink. We're doing more warband stuff. Real exciting warband stuff, I know. But if we can get through all of my alts, then I can get back to the currency stuff we were starting to do yesterday before warbands were giving some issues. Um, then we can get back to the fun stuff. You know, the actually fun stuff. So I didn't have time last night to finish this off stream. So back on stream it is. Here we go. Oh yeah. Real exciting. <laughs> Warbands. Yeah. It's a Thursday. <sighs> so yeah. Here we go. Silver is also here with me, technically. She's doing it too. So. I'm suffering. Exactly. <laughs> yep. I thought the pre-patch event started today. It was hoping to play some of it before realizing it's not for a couple days. Yeah, the uh, system changes and warbands and stuff of pre-patch came uh, on the 23rd, and then the actual event event part of it comes on the 30th, so next week. Hello, Focus. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Welcome. <clears throat> Glad to have you here. All right. Let's see here. So yeah, we're gonna get some alts organized, we're gonna feel good about ourselves and clean! Hello Young, welcome back. Welcome back to another alt stream. <laughs> Hello IKs, welcome. Welcome back. I'm getting all the heirloom weapons today that I had on a previous account from Mop. Ooh, nice! Yeah, I'm glad they... Gave us the chance to get the mop heirlooms again. I'm very pleased with that because I had some of them back from when it was current But because of their very poor drop rate back then I was not lucky enough despite raiding my pants off At the time I had only gotten a couple because your first one was guaranteed and then after that you don't get anything so <laughs> Like all right we So I'm uh, glad to have them all finally after literally over a decade that can no longer bother me. Now if they just bring back the phoenixes, I can finally finish getting those. One day. Oh, well wow, broke my game. Oh no. <laughs> Sorry, okay. <laughs> Hopefully get it fixed. Uh oh, crack and dwarf gang is gonna be a real thing. We're gonna stream it Saturday night. Ha <laughs> nice! I hope it's a fun time. That sounds awesome, Hex. Everybody's dwarves, right? Everybody? I mean, not everybody has to be a dwarf. But you, if you're gonna be the dwarf gang, you gotta be a dwarf, right? A dwarf. <laughs> Sounds fun. All dark iron dwarf paladins. Ooh, even the same type of dwarf and class. Dang. <laughs> you're going for the full paladin pal setup. I appreciate that. And hello, YFN. <laughs> Welcome back. How you doing? Glad to have you here again. What's funny, Silver? 
<laughs> I just had this image of all of them being dark iron dwarf paladins, like he, like like they said, mm. and then have that one normal dwarf in the center. Yes, the one non dark iron, just sneakily but still paladin. in there. <laughs> that would be pretty funny. <laughs> Kept joking about making them a biker gang in Moonguard, dude. You should. You totally should. <laughs> Uh, ride around on that weird, uh, expensive, uh, special bike mount from the, the bike event. 100k one. Yeah, the 100k one from a while back. That'd be funny. You can have a full raid with Dark Iron Dwarves. You definitely can. That's amazing. Get the one from Mechagon. Oh, that one's cool, too. That one's definitely cool. I guess it technically does count as a bike. The Piper Perry meme says hello to having one normal dwarf surrounded by a bunch of dark iron dwarves. Nice. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> I don't keep up with memes, to be honest. Ugh. Ah. <laughs> I'll tell you in Discord. Alright. Okay. But yeah, this is it. This is what we're doing for a little while until I can manage to get through all of my characters. Um, yeah, so, get all of these logged in, registered, it's the new patch, you know, get them all woke, woke up, rise them from the dead, go all a coup on them, rise them from the dead, there we go, can you try accessing the rogue order hall for, order hall for me real quick? I don't have any characters on any account but my main account uh, who has access to the order order hall. <laughs> I'm sorry. And my main account is currently being synced, so. Uh, the new UI icons are so nice. I'm actually working Argent Tournament dailies again. Nice. I know they are really nice. They look nice. I appreciate it. I don't actually unlock the order halls on almost all of my characters. This is live or beta? This is live. Live indeed. We are doing warband stuff on pre-patch. There we go. That's why we're cleaning up all of our alts. I would not be doing this if this were beta. Oh, my mouse is dying again. Gosh dang it, this mouse. There we go. This mouse dies insanely fast. I got used to them pretty quickly and pretty much everything else too. Nice. Well, that's good. Hello, Synchros. Synchros. Synchronos. <laughs> Sin, how you doing? Welcome back. Uh, question, do you know what class hall druid forms we cannot get at the moment? Uh, yeah, the class hall druid forms, the only one that you can't get is the mage tower one specifically. You can get all the other ones, they're still available. Unlocking order halls on alts is a solid meh. Unlocking garrisons on all your alts is strong and mighty. <laughs> exactly, Arnt. Thank you. Yeah, I only have the order halls unlocked on, I think, literally my mains, except for maybe a couple others who are older. Back when you had to have them unlocked to quest in the zones before they changed that in literally BFA. So, yeah. I don't have access to, like, most of them without doing the quest line. <laughs> uh. Oh, there we go. This mouse. There we go. There we go. Now the cord's up here. Okay. Right. Hello, Void. How you doing? Welcome back. Including the PvP ones? Correct. You can still get the PvP ones. Can confirm Silver got them a few months ago. And not even a few months ago. Like, a month ago. Recent. What did I get? The PvP skins for your druids. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're all still available. Only ones yep. you can't get are Mage Tower because they don't want us to get those again for some reason. So if you don't already have those, you're kind of screwed there. But everything else you can get. And there's still a lot, so that's nice. Hope everyone is doing well today. Hello, Brielle. Hello. Welcome. Glad to have you back. Welcome. With the, um... Sorry. Say welcome back to some more 
alt cleanup slash register slash login slash log out. <laughs> Fun. You were going to say? Uh, with the PvP ones, you need to get to level 90 for an entire row. Um, and then you need 10 RBGs for the... Is that the Mage Tower one? Or it's Mage Tower. That is Mage Tower. 10 RBGs is Mage Tower. All you okay, need okay, is okay. honor level 80 for the max. Um, I thought it was 90. No, it's 80. Uh... It's like 30, 50, 70, 80. Something like that. Okay. It might be 90. It's been a while. Either way, you can still get them. Uh, honestly, for being one of the most controversial things in WoW's history, I personally find Garrison's to have been one of their most evergreen systems they ever put in. Yeah, they really they really are, honestly. RBG's is Mage Tower. Correct. Yes. Luckily. Okay. She's good here. Hard pa pass on anything PvP here at any game. Totally understandable. Nice thing about uh, the honor system, though, if you're not doing rated PvP, you know, the honor slash, where is it, prestige system. Um, it's account-wide. Any character in your now-called warband, your entire account, will uh, get honor for it. And it's um, it doesn't require rating. You can get honor stuff just from doing world quests and open world PvP. Like, you don't even have to kill people for it to get honor. So any way that you get honor, it counts. So you can PvE your way to it, which is really nice. Uh, oh, I gotta open her thingy. Is there any druid forms I can get in Remix? I don't believe so. They didn't really start adding new druid forms until, like, f Legion? Unless you want to count the, which is a form now, but the, the fire kitty, which was just, you had to have a weapon equipped from Firelands, so Kata, but... That wasn't really made an actual form until pretty recent, you know, separate. So, nope, none and mop, none and mop. A uh, few I can log into onto my mage again, transferring currency and him from him lagged out <laughs> last night and bricked the character so I couldn't log on. Oh no! Well, it sounds like it sounds like it fixed, so that's good. So, what I have looked forward to when I finally have my PC working slash running effi effi efficiently? <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, it is. Most of the time, uh, I accept the first quest because I hate when they follow you around down and holler at you. Yeah, same. That most, almost all of my characters have at least the first quest, so they leave me alone. <laughs> uh, when in doubt, reinstall clean copy windows. Yep, there you go. Hopefully that works. I suffered through RBGs back in Legion to get my red glaives, and then did it again to get the skunk bear appearance. I know, I've only done it on my paladin, and even then I got carried. I used to do RBGs a lot back in WAD, um, but I just, they weren't great after, um, I didn't enjoy them after Legion, so PvP kind of fell off for me. Alright, we're just fine. Any way to sort character list by server? Uh, not unless you do it manually. There's no sorting option, I don't think, that does it for you. You can search feature, but there's no sorting, to my knowledge. Just manual. Okay, this account is done, so Excellent. Alright, and speaking of sorting, we're gonna swap accounts now. What even is that picture? This meme template. I've never seen that meme. Uh, Aaron, uh, <laughs> Silver shared that meme you're talking about with me. I've never seen that. In all the memes I've seen, I've never seen that one. That's weird. It's okay. an old one. Kind of creepy. Um, here. Let's see. All right, let's get on six. Ooh, that one expires in two hours. I need to skedaddle. Skadoodle. There you go. Skadoodly boodly. Ah, okay. That explains why I've never seen it. Yeah, it, it used to be, like, really, really popular a good few years ago now. Gotcha. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, I love Garrison so much, it would be nice to have more skips setting them up, but it isn't too bad. I don't know why they would bother. Yeah, fair. <laughs> you still have to get that stuff, uh, Staff Transmog to unlock Fire Kitty, right? I believe so, yes. You have to get it, like, once? 
Or no, you don't have to get the staff. I think it's a... The toy version is the one that gives you appearance now, because if you get the toy, you get the appearance unlocked, which you can do in the barbershop. I don't know. I did the whole chain. I had the staff when it had to be that. I had the toy when it had to be that. And now I have the actual form when they turned it into that. So I don't actually know if you don't have any of that, what you have to do. <laughs> I think it would be the toy, is my guess. I built this PC and it's awesome. It was just uh, having issues to due to what I suspect to be a crappy Asus armory crate that broke my system. Ah, that's annoying. If you search realm, does it pull up those characters or is it just by name? I have no idea. I don't personally like the search function, but I can look for you. Earth, uh, moon? No, it doesn't, the, moon, the realm doesn't seem to come up. It looks like it's just by name. Or faction, you can do faction. Realm doesn't seem to come up though. Yeah. No realm. No realm search. Toy the Fandral seed pouch. Perfect. Good to know. Good to know. For sure I heard you can search, even search by covenant. Interesting. Well, let's see. Night. Bay. Hmm. Well, night face seems to come up. Necro. Uh, maybe it doesn't work very well. Kiri, no. It's bringing up night fae. I think. No, maybe not. These are... No, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I don't ever plan on using it myself because I have them organized into a specific spreadsheet which I'm going to do real quick because this is a new uh, account so let me get these guys all in order and then we can continue on our merry way let's see paladins get this guy up um let's see, we need Li Fang Wall, Musa, and Nambu so, where'd go? Tear me some. All right, and then we need Hafeen, Hesse, and Crawl. So warriors, There's Hafeen. And we need Hesse. Oh, I might put them all the way down there. And Crawl. Okay. Now we need Death Knights, Round Vu, Kin, and Candy. Uh, Round Vu. We need Kin. And we need Candy. I'll look at chat once I get these guys all organized. I have to stare at my um, spreadsheets to get them in the right order. I need Hunters. Vesla. So let's pull up all the Hunters. Hunter. It's like it reversed my character list. It did it backwards. A lot of it. It's really weird. She is stiff. Poor Vesla is not moving. Oh, that's a little weird. Oh, there it goes. She just had to think about it. <laughs> She's like, oh, nobody move. They hunt their prey by movement. Soonchi. Okay, so Vesla is top. Uh, Iska. Uh, Soonchi. Uh, Kuga. Uh, and Kreejun. Okay. Now we need shamans. So we need shamis. Shamalama Ding Dong. Shammy. Mm. Or other Shammy. That's only two. There's Noeme and Utheldri. Where's Shaladrin? There she is. 
There we go. Okay. Astalor, I need my one evoker. There he is. And then we need druids. Palm out. Oops. There we go. Uh, ID. ID, here he is. And Killium. I love this new song, I really do. It's like, I hum it. It's very hummable. I like songs that are very, like, memorable. They don't have to have words, just a tune that I can remember. This and Dawn. Okay, and then we need Monks. Sapu. Excellent. So, Sapu, Nith. Uh, Korta, then Nith. Alright. And who else up here? There we go. Okay. Now we need my demon hunters. We're getting there. We're almost there. And then I can pay attention to my 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 babies in stream. Hargoon and Rordrist. Uh, now we need a Fermina and Mariasu. It's a Getty first, and then Nori. Okay, I have Serene, Maju Maju, um, Maladin, Maldin rather, and Zarko, Soya, Salya, and Greeling. Okay, now we can now we can log in. We can begin the actual stuff. I'm back now that I I can continue to not. Ignore you now. <laughs> I'm back. Okay, wow, does it remember favorite characters for me? Is it okay, you? Yeah, it hasn't forgotten uh, my favorites yet. I've been off and on my accounts multiple times, at least, you know, the ones that I've already finished so far, so. Uh, I don't have the toy, but my druid does have the barbershop option. I do have the staff, though. Maybe it's by both staff or toy, so whatever you had at, um, counts. So that's good if that's the case. Name in fa name faction and class, I think. That makes sense. Nice, nice. Good afternoon and happy prefetch week, everyone. Hello, Miranda. Welcome back. Glad to have you back. Oh, they really do need a to add a filter and grouping options or just a sorting order. Yeah, something. Bessa did not want to be chosen. No, she didn't. <laughs> no, she didn't. All right, I gotta do my bags on this one. Oh, there we go. Hi there, have you released a bid on war a vid on war bands? I have not, but I can definitely recommend Mr. GM. He's got a good video of that up. His is the one that I watched, so I have not. I don't know that I'll be putting anything up on war bands because I would pretty much just be regurgitating information that's already in a good um Wowhead document. So I don't know that I would add be able to add much, so uh, yeah, I really want to be able. Uh, let me start over. I really want to be able to group. I wonder if enough players are degen with enough characters for it to be an issue for Blizzard to worry about, or if most players only have a handful of characters. Yeah, it's hard to say. Did you see a new load screen that was teased? I did. I did see it. I told people it would be something cool. I don't know why they don't listen to me. <laughs> I know things. That's what I do. I drink coffee, and I know things. <laughs> That's my whole life. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's get this um, cleaned up here. Uh, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Theme transparency. We want fifty-three. Remove borders. Icons. Icons. Gray. Gray. We want forty-four. And auto open. All of these. Okay, now I need Opie. Not Opie. Mask. Mm, this is not alphabetical. There it is. Agonator. Off. Oops, not off, actually. Actually. I need. 
Not off. I need blizzard enhanced. There we go. That's better. Oh, I need to turn off. Where's the thing of a jig? Icons. Sorting? Sort of button categories. Where is it at? Where was that? I don't want the. There it is. Recent character tabs. Nah. Nah. Alright. There. She's good now. Anywho. Oh, let me back up here. Now I can only see what you're saying. Kraken has turned me into a D gen, but I'm just getting started. <laughs> you are a young gen. A young D? A D young. That sounds weird. A baby G gen. D gen. We'll go with that. <laughs> What are your plans after you feel like your alts are all good? Back to remix before it's over? Maybe. We'll see, to be honest, because by the time I'm kind of finished with my alts being all good, the pre-patch event's probably going to start. It's already Thursday, and that's like next Tuesday. So that's going to take probably a couple weeks. It really depends on how fast um, we can finish the pre-patch stuff to determine if I go back to remix, because I would kind of like to actually at least get the weapons from the scenarios but at the same time I'm so freaking burnt out on it I think Silver and I are kind of pretending it doesn't exist right now so I don't know we'll see we'll see uh, I'm not a fan at all where uh, my characters are in one giant drop down list I liked it better where my characters were sorted in my realms you and me both a goose like on one hand it's kind of nice that they're on one list but on the other hand that like because I play on multiple realms, that makes it kind of annoying. Because, like, I have all my main stuff on one realm, but, you know, I do have other alts. Or other realms. I don't know. I don't know. Not entirely a fan. Not entirely a fan. Oh, uh, let's see where we're at. You're very welcome, Pagmania. Mr. GM is fantastic for keeping up with current content. I'm not very good at doing that. I'm more of kind of a legacy guide maker, I'm, with, with rare exceptions, to be honest. So, you want to see new stuff right when it needs to be out, go check out Mr. GM's channel. He'll get you covered. He does fantastic guides. I kind of leave the, uh, the, um, I don't know what you'd call it. Trend following? No. The, the news stuff to the, to the pros. I don't like chasing after whatever's new and making a guide about it ASAP. That get, gets me kind of burned out, to be honest. So, uh, right, I can't open that yet. Alright, we'll just wait. I should go run Firelands on my dirt for that time toy now, though. Now that I can still unlock mogs for my main. Yes! Nice! That'll be good. Understood, although I do like to hear you theorize on uh, how you manage your alt army. Yep, I will uh, probably do another alt army video. That's probably the only, like, Warbands-related thing I'll do about it. Um, most of the systems are pretty... I would say self-explanatory. Once you kind of look at it, you're like, Oh yeah, I get how this works. It's pretty... It just does its thing, you know? So there's not really any guides for me to make there. If I find... Figure out one, I will, but... Oh. Hi there, Kraken and chat. Is Warband running yet? Hello. Drethen subscribed to your channel for 17 months. Hello, Drethen. Welcome. Thank you so much for the resub. Super appreciate your continued support. Because thanks to folks like you, I can keep working. And yes, warbands have been working fine since launch. The only thing that isn't working is the war bank. Other than that, I haven't really had too many issues with anything else warband related. Personally. But I've not been trying to farm stuff either. I've not been trying to farm rep either, so I can't speak for those. But otherwise, yeah, Warbands have been going great. Worked on that all day yesterday, and now we're doing it again today. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, but yeah, I'll be doing more alt army videos in the future. Uh, not anytime soon, but in the next expansion, I definitely will. Kraken Lannister, Hand of King. <laughs> how you doing? Welcome back. I like how Kraken is an ethical YouTuber compared to some of the dumb ones who post 15 different clickbait videos on a single topic all drawn out and say the same thing. Well, thank you, Arnt. And to be fair, like, I get it. I get why people do that. Like, they need that money. I get it. That's what they're after. But YouTube is not a great source of, of income. Ironically, Twitch is like three to four times better. Huh, <laughs> funny that. If you're looking for income specifically. 
but it also takes a lot of work. I put a lot of time and effort into my guides, and if I'm gonna do one, I want it to be one I'm actually gonna use, not just something that's kind of like regurgitated, if that makes sense. So, I appreciate the compliment. Thank you, Arent. All right, I should stop looking at that because the guild bank is borky. Oh, what I think would be a genius feature, especially after, uh, or that they add more scenes, is to allow you to have as many groups of four as you want, so you can group up your characters similar mods, specific location, and some other campfire uh, diorama, etc. As far as for as many as you want, I would love that to be honest. I would love that. Wait, all characters are together now? Oh no, I haven't played since June. Shaking off the rest and getting ready for War Within. Yes, in your... For each account, since you can have up to eight count accounts on one Battle.net account, each... Your entire Battle.net is your Warband. It's just the new term for account-wide is Warband. It just sounds cooler, so I see why they're promoting it that way. It's easier just to, just to say Warbands instead of being like, account-wide this, account-wide that, you know. But all of your alts are in the warband, but each account, all of your character lists from all the different realms that you play on have been visually merged. They're still treated like separate realms, but you don't have to swap between them anymore, which that part's nice. Um, but they are in one big long list now <laughs> instead of being separate. So <laughs> yeah, it's been interesting. It's been interesting. Yeah, it's been interesting. Sort of mine by realm. Yeah, I did mine um, just by one, uh, just by armor type, class and armor type. So paladin, warrior, death knight, hunter, druid, monk, etc. Um, it's how I have it on my spreadsheets, so it uh, it works out. Updated add-on list too. Yep, that'll be out is in uh, War Within as well. It'll probably be almost the exact same as what I'm using now. So if you'd like to know what I'm using now, go check out my previous add-on list. Like 95% of it is pretty much always the same and probably will continue to be. So that is something to keep in mind. I never liked having multiple realms. I always liked all my characters together. No, I'm the same way. I had all of my characters on the same realm until they announced cross-realm guilds. And then I started undeleting all of these old characters um, that I had so that they could be in the same guild. Which, the guilds are not working super hot right now, but you can invite them at least. Uh, the whole warbands, four characters warbands, warband bank, warbands, bind on equip, is why people are so confusing what warbands is. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Everything is a warband. It's just, it's literally just the new term for account wide. That's really it, to be honest. Time to log in. Have fun, Drethen. Hope you enjoy. Check your add-ons first. Is there a way to boost tunes uh, from the other faction remix? I have max horde tune I want to build up with my alt army. I'm not sure. I don't boost my own tunes myself. I prefer to level the natural way. So that would be a question for chat. Twitch pays more than YouTube? That's a shock. Yeah, by like a lot. <laughs> That's a sad thing. By a lot. By a lot. But the source of income is very different as well. Like, unless I take uh, sponsors, which I don't really want to do on my YouTube channel, all of my income is either through random donations, if people feel like doing that, which is very rare, or um, ad revenue, which is very, very, very low. So, very low. Whereas here, I get paid kind of through ads, but mainly through you guys supporting me as subscribers. Which I get 60% of that, because it's a 60-40, because I qualified for the 60-40 instead of the 50-50. So, way more from one per person than it is on, uh, on YouTube. So, big difference. Uh, Lottie, do you have a section in Discord where we can post our PC setups? I'd look, uh, but I don't have Discord reinstalled quite yet. I don't think so, but you can just post in pictures, screenshots, the main chat, wherever you want, to be honest. I I'm pretty lax with the rules. As long as you're not a jerk, we're, we're, I'm pretty fine. <laughs> you know? 
Yeah, uh. that would that would go in like that would go in like pictures. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Good morning, Mecha King. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Oh, just the favorites are around the campfire. I am finally just about caught up now. Yes, if you'd like to see the whole um kind of the preview of it. Here's the Blizzard preview, that link, that can get you kind of an idea on what warbands are. Which it really is just kind of the term, new term for account-wide stuff. The Warband Bank is an account-wide bank for warband gear and unbound mats and things like that. Uh, warband reputation is just account-wide reputation, etc. So... It can definitely be a little confusing, but once you get it, you're like, oh, okay, that's just... I mean, it's, it's, it's simple. Uh, or can I post uh, to Twitch and link it here if that's allowed? Just wanted to show you Silver and chat my cool setup. You're more than welcome to, by all means. You can post it wherever you like. Belly Lair got so bad with this constant spam that it prompted me to not only tell YouTube to ignore all his videos for me, but I ranted every chance I can get to tell as many people as possible. That he's a no skill act with terrible takes and should be ignored because consuming his content make you worse. Wow. ah, I'm sorry, Arnt. I feel that though. I get it. I totally understand. I'm definitely not going to slander anyone myself because uh, I don't have any qualms with it personally, but you know, he's getting that bag. I respect the hustle. My faves are going to be my main character and my three bank AH tunes. A oh, nice. <laughs> Makes sense to me. Uh, my faves are ironically literally just the top four alts in my spreadsheet list, which is usually paladins and warriors. <laughs> so <laughs> that's all that's going up there for me. That way I don't, you know, get confused with my list. Uh, you can uh, not boost yourself cross faction remix. It's queued content and you can't uh, cross faction group two things for the person who asks. Ah, perfect. Thank you, Goose. That's a bummer, but makes sense. My game is so buggy, it keeps crashing now and again, and bags don't want to open. Oh, no. Duh, I said post Twitch, but I meant post Twitter. I, weirdly, I knew exactly what you meant. I know you wrote Twitch, but I knew you meant Twitter. Like, I don't know why, but I did know. So don't worry, I knew exactly what you meant. Uh, I'm still LVY for the time being. There's an LVY issue. Definitely check if you need to, to update LVY. Mine's working great, actually. They updated it yesterday. It's been all fixed for me, so. Mm -hmm. Hi, Kraken. If Hi, Silver. Well, go ahead. If you're using the bag option, maybe turn that off. Disa yeah, disable the bag option in LVY. Yeah, there's some been base blizzard bag issues. I know that much. Hello, Maromi. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Now I lurk to work on my old on my paladin. Nice. Have fun, your paladin. Maromi said hi. Hi, Maromi. Don't have LVI. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Kraken sees non-paladins and starts getting confused. <laughs> exactly. Like, huh? Where's my paladins? Uh, what zone are you and Silver most looking forward to in War Within? I honestly don't know because I've spent zero time on beta in the new zones. All I did on beta was test old stuff and legacy things and give feedback on that. Um, so I have no idea. I don't even know the names of the zones besides the Nerubian looking place, which I still don't even know the name of. So I have no I idea. Don't, I don't know what they look like. <laughs> I don't either. I was so excited to do beta. <laughs> Although, I guess the only one I would know- I know, I'm sorry. We were gonna do a lot of beta stuff, like, for the record, that's what she's talking about. But Remix happened! It was yeah. Silver's first official beta with me. Mm-hmm. And Remix happened, so we didn't get to do beta together. Maybe Holofall? I, I think that's the only route zone I actually know about, just because WoW had posted so much about it. That's about it, though, to be honest. Oh, I forgot about Hollow Fall. That's like the only thing I know about it. It's just the name. I have no idea what it's about or what it looks like. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh, we're physically psych psychically psychic wow. Psychic psychically wow, that's a word. Psychically linked. Cyclically. Psychically? Cyclically. Why is that weird to say? Anyway. Psychic linked. <laughs> Mogget was mugging the bags. Oh, that's weird. Uh 
I guess if you- I haven't used Mogget in ages. I used Can I Mogget, but Mogget itself hasn't worked for me in ages. I'm surprised that one's still around. I miss it sometimes. Ye old Mogget. Do you remember Mogget, Silver? I do, I do remember Mogget. It's been a long time since I've used that. Legendary. <laughs> miss it. Another bug in BFA, a lot of the quest marker arrow things are underground far beneath where the quests are. <laughs> oh, that's spooky. I'm going in completely spoiler free, so stoked. Well, beta spoiler free. Yeah, I'm, I think I actually know besides like systems changes in terms of zones, story, like mostly what's going on in the next expansion. I think this is actually the least spoiled expansion I've had in a long time. I don't care about spoilers personally. I've just not been super interested in the story and stuff. Dragonflight kind of killed me on that. I really did not enjoy Dragonflight's story. The zones are gorgeous, but even the zone stories I didn't care for. So I wasn't interested enough to care to go read. I haven't even read the sort stories that they've been doing. So I'm a little out of the loop on that. I kind of haven't cared. <laughs> so we'll find out. Uh, I don't care to know some details so long as uh, the first time I'm playing it myself is on launch. Yeah, completely fair. I'm, I'm that way too, to be honest. Can I mog it as the best? Yes! I mean, can I mog it? Sorry. Oh, gotcha. Well, that's weird. I wasn't having any issues with that one myself. Oh, I guess it depends on what everyone's add-on setup. Stuff is going to conflict. The new color for Warband Collected is pink. Really? Just like regular, uh... Regular mog collect? That's interesting. Makes sense. That way it matches the pre-existing, uh, you learned this item thing. Cool. That's good, because I'm already trained. I don't have to retrain myself on color. I hope there's an add-on that will revert the new map icons to the old ones. I don't like that they're so obnoxious now. They felt far more trim before. I'm sure there will be. I can imagine that. I personally like the new ones myself. I actually probably helped getting them changed. <laughs> I requested a lot of changes. I don't like the old ones. So, sorry about that. I haven't heard really much story spoilers, even without trying to avoid them. Yeah, same. I haven't really seen a lot of story spoilers either, to be honest. I know some things, but very, like, mini minimal things. Alright, so that's good. We're good there on him. By the way, just to confirm, the heirlooms that I have enchanted gemmed are now soulbound. I hear that is going to be fixed how it was before this patch. From what I read, yes. I haven't messed with it myself, but that's what Wowhead said. So, in the next, what are those, point one or point two? Pretty soon. So, whenever that happens. I think they're keeping the good stuff hidden away in beta. Well, that's good. Add-ons in WoW can be super finicky at times. Oftentimes you'll have add-ons that are completely fine for most people. But how they load on your account causes issues. I've had times where I have almost game-breaking Lua errors that'll disable all, slowly re reload them all, and then they magically start working. Yeah, exactly. Like, you know, I, I even Silver and I have that. She'll have add-ons break that I'm also using that are still working perfectly fine. So I'm like, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> That's why, like, I can't help people a lot of the time when it comes to add-on diagnosis because I don't know. I probably know about as much as you do on this stuff. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> so, I don't know. I load it. If I like it, I use it. And if it continues to work, I leave it alone. I don't really fiddle with stuff. Oh, that's great because my heirloom alt is like 80 heirlooms all gemmed and enchanted soulbound. Oh, no. Yeah, that's what I read in the Wowhead post. I saw one. How do, how do add-ons work in WoW? Magic. Pretty much. Pretty much. Pretty much. Uh, happy time zone all, being a simple caveman who just got home from work. Any word on when the Warband Bank is becoming usable? No word yet that I've seen, but I know they are working on it. I know they disabled cross-realm trading and the... Crossrealm Guild isn't 100% working either. I, from what I read, they're all related. Crossrealm issue stuff. So whenever they fix it, I guess. 
Jeff the prop subscribed to your channel for four months. Thank you so much, Jeff, for the resub. Super appreciate your continued support, because thanks to folks like you, I can keep working. So, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Uh, yeah, usually best to find the ad on Dev Discord to find it if it's really bad. Yeah, exactly. I like doing, um, in, uh, what do you call it? On both Curse and Wow Up, depending on what manager you use, if you right click it, you can go to the add ons website. If I find like there's an issue with it, I can go there and look at the comments or the issues. Sometimes they have a GitHub um, where they're posting like beta patch fixes and stuff. You know. So, doing a little bit of research on that part can sometimes help. Let's see. Let's hearth him back to Dalaran. He doesn't need to be here anymore. Using him was a poor choice. I'm sure they have been working non-stop on the issues. I mean, already did the 14-hour day. Right? They are... I'm sure Blizzard's kind of on fire right now. <laughs> As it is with pretty much every patch, to be honest. Hey, anything that... Uh, if you drive past their HQ, it's just on fire. It's just the roof. <laughs> yeah, it's just smoke coming out the vents. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. There we go. I'm kind of annoyed that it re it reversed all of my void storage unlocks. Not all of them, but a lot of them. There we go. Refresh Wowhead. Uh, they'll be good on reporting the warband stuff. Yes, indeed. And that also, I also have a war a wow a Wowhead page news page channel in my discord too which is where i get all of it because i have a bot that posts to it so it likes posting repeats but you know i started getting uh started using baginator and i'm still getting used to it but i like it same water goddess same uh i'm tired of uh as much as i love bagnon kind of tired of dealing with it and baginator is very similar i can set it up to do roughly the same things so I'm just gonna stick with this one for a while until I think otherwise. Until I find something that it just can't do. But so far it's been pretty much the same, so. Baginator have been working good. You know what would have been really cool? Imagine if Blizzard set up a sort of testing realm where they could add multiple servers that public could use and test for recent content and live servers. <laughs> Uh, the shade has been thrown. Uh, honestly, I thought more stuff would have been broken than there actually is. Yeah, same, to be honest. I know we're complaining about the few things that are, but it's a lot smoother than I was expecting. I was expecting not even be able to log in. Like, I was expecting literal fire to start spewing out of my computer. Somehow coming up through the wires from Blizzard. So... <laughs> Yeah. <sighs> Alright. Some of these characters I'm not opening their banks on because I have them camping stuff, so it's fine. Same. I just expected the worst, <laughs> right? Same. The issue is it goes smooth on PTR and they do it like a. Uh, do it with 100 million plus accounts live. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's kind of how I. I've been looking at it too. Like, I know they test stuff, this stuff in PTR. It was working great. Same with beta. But, you know. Uh, this type of issue can't really be tested on PTR. It requires a live service. PTR doesn't attract a fraction of the player base. Yeah, completely fair. What were you... you tack on 100 million plus people. Yeah. Good grief. Yeah. That'll crash anything. <laughs> mm hmm. Uh, I still understand why Blizz doesn't have 24 hour maintenance to make sure stuff works right. They probably do. They probably do. I wouldn't doubt it. I think my only real complaint of substance so far, mind you, is that the I feel the five seconds of switching flight style is needlessly excessive. <laughs> Completely understandable. I was using the default LBY's bags, but I want to try the category sort and didn't like Addy bags. Nice. See, I didn't like the category sort part, but I like that it has the option for folks. I like uh, that I can set it up to be 
Just one big single bag, and it does my bank. It won't sort stuff for me unless I tell it to. It'll just sit there and collect dust until I want to clean it, so I, I, I like that. I don't like things being cleaned for me. I'm like, no, that's not how I would clean it. <laughs> you know. Uh. There we go. All right. I don't think I ever focus uh, tested cross realm warband stuff. I generally get people on a realm and use it solo. And the most they, they most they did was have a character on these go to eleven for max level testing, and then a character on leveling realm, and those realms were actually separated from each other. Yeah, understandable. Uh, they should have like five mounts that you can use old flying with while others are sky riding. See, I'm definitely the opposite. I'm annoyed that not all of the mounts have uh, um, sky riding. Honestly. You're in luck. The flying uh, fish from the trader's post is not a sky riding mount. The... Are you sure? I can check that one for you if you want. Because so far the only one that's not a sky riding mount that we've seen is the uh, thingamajig. I'm pretty sure it is. Here, what was that fish called? Fish. It does it come up? The wave is the wave whisker. Um Wondrous Wonder It's not coming. Wondrous That's the wave whisker. Where's the other one? Is it the behemoth? Behe no. Under like corrupted. Let me try that. Under. No. I do. Oh, duh. It's because I don't have it. <laughs> do you have it, Silver? Did you buy the Nizoth fish? Uh, I think I have that saved. Yeah, I have it froze. That's why in my mind I have yep. it, but I have it frozen because <laughs> I couldn't afford it. It was like 800 freaking whatever's and I wanted to buy the the other transmog so I didn't buy it but yeah I thought I bought it no it's mine is also frozen <laughs> anyway if anyone else wants to try it I'm pretty sure it is the only one that Blizzard has said is not a sky riding mount is specifically the Autuk which is really annoying and I can confirm that one does not sky ride it won't even fly if you have sky riding turned on it's very irritating Hmm. All right, next character. Otherworldly all tuck not being sky riding I thought would save you from the flight button, but no mount locked otherwise. <laughs> I'm sorry the flight button bugs you so much. It's kind of funny to be honest. <laughs> oh, I get it though. I get it. Well, let me sky ride it. The underlight corrupted. It does sky ride. Yep, the fish. There you go. It does. All the fish that can fly can have sky ride. Any reports to the contrary are out of date. It sky rides. Perfect. It's not a sky riding mount before the pre patch. I know that much. Old uh, angler, old god angler does sky ride. Perfect. I flew on both the store and the trading post fish. Well, there you go. Thank you everyone for confirming. There we go. So here's my current PC setup. I bought the parts of uh, the PC itself, which was a chore. This way I was able to get it looking the way I wanted to. Nice. Respect the hustle. Ooh. I like it. It's really pretty. Hey, I like clear-sided machines like that. That's what mine is. Mine's Same. all clear. It Same. makes me happy. There you go. You got a like from me. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Clear-sided makes, makes stuff look cool. I don't know why, but... Does anyone know if there is a one-handed spear in the game or something that looks relatively similar to it? Ooh, I can't think of any... Off the top uh, of my head. I'm on a druid. I can look. I cannot look. I'm a liar. <laughs> I don't know, Arbany. That's a that's a hard one to ask. All the uh, spear-like weapons I can think of are two-handed. They're either pole arms or staves. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, stretchies. Yeah. There. 
Uh, if it, it depends on what you're playing, because I know there are like some offhand staffs you can use. True, there are some offhands that do that look like, like that. Oh, you want a spear yeah. and a shield? Uh. Yeah. Yeah, ironically, that's not something I think we can really do without like using Fury specifically. Then you're like a fake tank. Then you can't use some of your abilities, so it's kind of fake annoying. Tank. Fake tank. Uh, I'm gonna rogue. Let me let me look. Oh yeah, me too. I love the uh, uh, NZ XT glass cases. Mine is also angled on the side for me, but I wish I had liquid cooling for extra lights. But at least I have Corsair cards giving me some RGB. Nice. Quite a few one-handed swords or maces that can look like pull arms. Oh, are there? Nice. I guess it depends on what you consider a pull arm. I can't think of any that come to my mind. Uh... Hi, Lottie and Silver. Forgot to say hi. I'm gold grinding before the drought. Nice. Hello, Ofi. Welcome back. Hello, Ofi. Good luck with your grinding. Thanks. Did you notice the wallpaper? I did indeed. Yes. I used, made that using Mid Journey based on my WoW Void Elf Priest, Genevieve. I've done that for most of my characters with great results from the right prompts. Nice. Definitely fun. Definitely fun. Not sure where I heard about the drought, but I did hear one was coming. Uh, I haven't heard about a drought coming, but I know I could imagine gold values might get nerfed again. I can see it. I wouldn't doubt it. I do not have those yet, but I'll look for them. Nice. Nice and cool, nice and cool. Alright. Oh. Maintenance. This is my maintenance. There we go. There we go. Watch your out, like the rain in your area. I'm assuming that she's referring to uh, a gold drought. In WoW. That's why she's farming gold. Unless I'm mistaken. Yeah, I'm so annoyed. I had a lot of. I had these all unlocked. I better fix it, because that's a lot of gold to be out. Uh, the DF World Quest would be, uh, at least be nerfed as we're getting uh, towards the start of War Within, right? More than likely. Depends on how quick they are to nerf it. Like, from uh, BFA to DF, they nerfed them pretty dang immediately. But from, like, Legion to, to uh, BFA, they didn't. They took a while. So it... You know, Blizzard. They're a loose cannon with this stuff. <laughs> Uh. There we go. Uh, Alright. Pop open that. Nice. And numbers definitely have been shifting around, so this is helping. Beautiful. Beautiful. One hour down, three to go. Let's see, what account are we technically on? Six, seven, eight. Six expires in a couple hours, so I need to, uh, I need to sync that one. I need to sync this one when I'm done with it so I don't have to mess with it later. I can just stay down. Uh, yeah. What gold drought? The best way to make gold is never focusing and relying on one source of gold making. I don't know. I haven't heard about a drought coming, but we'll find out. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to do more of those, especially the archives ones, so I can finish buying that big dig vendor. Nice. I saw some gold makers talking about raw gold farms and older instances like Skyreach being uh, much higher to do and vendor trash gray, gray items being like two three times as much. Said it yesterday I'll say it again. While rugged farms are nice for us, uh, bots will abuse it and the over system will be worse because of it. Got you. I'm definitely the opposite. I definitely disagree with you. <laughs> but yeah, the uh, 
Raw gold in the old instances apparently has gone up. Probably from the item level change or something. But I wouldn't doubt it if they decided to go in and nerf it, because you know how Blizzard is. They don't like us playing old content. Oh, you're having fun in an expansion that's not current? Mm-mm, can't have that. I won't have it. It's bad, okay? <laughs> you need to be over here. In the new stuff. I'm like, but I don't want to be over there. I want to be over here. <laughs> Alright. Almost done with this account. Is the Warband Bank fixed yet? I don't believe so. I've not seen anything posted about it. I see people primarily blaming Ian for no old fun allowed. <laughs> really? He probably doesn't even have any say in that. It's kind of funny to be honest. Uh, I don't think that's true or else why would they make transmog the way it is now? I mean... It's up to them, I suppose. They need to make an auction house region-wide on every single thing. Agreed. I would very much appreciate that. I'm waiting for Mog and pets and mounts and stuff to go region-wide. That would be super nice. I know all the gold sellers, the hardcore uh, sellers would freak, but I'm not one of them. I'd like to buy Mog. Please. Have a nice day. Uh... I think they do like us uh, and understand that we do well, like old content farming, but you just said they don't like us old farming content. Correct. They don't like us farming old content. That's why a lot of old stuff gets nerfed or buffed in ways that it makes it kind of hard. Uh, I don't go on or post on Twitter slash X a lot, but going with just now, I saw a tweet that brought back a weird misunderstanding. I was searching being searching Bing's co-pilot AI for pris or for poison questions regarding my rogue and got the following responses. <laughs> nice. Uh, I'd like to sell Mog. Earth and Ring isn't great for selling stuff in the auction house. No, lower pop realms are definitely not. And like inversely, Moonguard is technically great for selling it, but it's terrible for buying it, ironically, in my opinion, because it's so freaking expensive. I never buy Mog on Moonguard. Don't do it. It's ten times as much. It's ridiculously expensive. Uh, why do they hold back with class restrictions on tier set farming? It's such a bummer. I know, it's really annoying. I really hope it's just a technical reason and they're not like, no, nah, we just don't want you getting the old tier with any, any class. I hope it's a technical thing, not a, like a principle thing, because that'd be a bit silly. Uh, so I ask, why did they enable us to learn all mods they don't want from my old content? Or are you just referring to the gold? In general. Mostly gold, but in general. And why... If you're asking why they enable us to earn, learn mo all my items as mogs, I have no idea that it's up to them. Probably because it's been something that's been asked for many times. I can't speak for Blizzard. I have no idea. <laughs> Not a clue. I don't work for them. What do you think about the new human racial? I actually don't know what it is. I don't remember. What, what's the new human racial? Is that the two hearthstone thing? Uh, I think so. Cool. I have no idea. I don't know. I never use racials, to be honest. So it's probably fine? <laughs> uh, probably fine. I sell uh, on MG. Pet smogs are nice. Very cool. Very cool. You're saying... Uh, so you're saying sell Mog on Moonguard? If you want, I say don't buy it on Moonguard. I don't know why people buy Mog on Moonguard. It's so much more expensive than anywhere else. I specifically don't buy here because of that. It's a little insane. Uh, the reason given uh, I read in Mr. GM's interview was to keep class identity intact. Ah, so it is a principal thing. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Because honestly, that undermines the whole transmog change thing they just did, so... Rip. I hope that's not true. Uh, racials are whatever for those of us who don't do high-end game content. Yeah, <laughs> I think the only racial I actually really use is Shadow Melt. Uh. Yeah, don't buy. Yeah, no. Too expensive. Uh, never use racials. Will the Forsaken save my butt so many times because of charms, sleeps, and fears being so uh, more common nowadays? I honestly never use racials. <laughs> but I don't, again, I don't do like 
competitive stuff anymore, so, you know. I mean, it's not that they don't want us to ever do old content, but they have a history of trying to make sure players are staying in new content as much as possible. Kind of just the nature of making a video game. Exactly, Witch Hobbit. You nailed it. And being a person who primarily does legacy, that is definitely how it comes across. They could just as easily make those class items war bound just like tier tokens. Agreed. I would think they could. I hope it's actually a technical thing, but... If it really is a, uh... A, uh, principal thing that's painfully unfortunate, because it really undermines the whole thing. Okay, I need to sync that account, so hold on a second. Let me pull that up, because that's going to expire before stream ends. And I don't want to deal with it later. So hold on, everybody, i got to sync my ATT. Grab that, and I need to grab my six before that expires. There we go. Hold on, I am uh, getting that account, account set up so it can sync ATT. Because I don't have any reason to continue paying for that sub right now. Come on, log in. I know you want to. Alright. I log in on my Pally Wally. Hmm. Taking a hot second to log in. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Alright, are you sinking? It is sinking. Okay, I can ignore that now. Just wanted to make sure I, uh, I got that going since that account is almost donezo. Alright, let's look at chat real quick. Uh, I can see them removing racials and adding them like a talent. That'd be kind of cool. I don't think people would like them removing racials. I'm kind of indifferent personally because they don't feel that impactful to me but you know not even in a high end setting just out in the world fears are the most common like no don't fear me into eight more mobs i'm just trying to quickly do this quest gotcha i guess in the old world i just kill stuff too fast so i never even notice oh uh, they're open to feedback they said though so there's still a little hope i know i've given them feedback on this multiple times but we'll see if uh jess brown 359 followed your channel Thank you so much, Jess Brown, for the follow. Glad to have you here, and I hope you enjoy your stay. Welcome. Uh, they just don't want to get you, want you to be playing WoW as much as possible in any way. <laughs> Oops, not that. Exactly. <laughs> uh, anywho, porridge is done, slow cooking, I imagine. Be back in a jiffy. Nice! Love using my random sky mount button now. Being able to sky ride on Hogress, swine of good fortune. Pigs with little wings. Cute. Chinese zodiac mounts are one of the best shop things they've ever done. They are super cute. I do love them. Okay, let me ignore chat for a sec. I need to organize this account. As you can see, it is not in order. Okay, so I need paladins. So Mortanus needs to be actually on number three. And Elthic here needs to be down here. And Jazzy right after him, and Nailska after him. Alright, let's go get the paladins. Where did they put my paladins? Probably down here. Ah, uh, yeah, because these have not been logged into yet. That's fine. Mortanus. We need Ibishai. Where'd he go? There he is. Here we are. Oh, it didn't move it. Okay. Let's try that again. There. Alright. So there's that. Okay. Elvik, Benjazu, Nilska. Uh, now we need Death Knights. Let's grab the Death Knights. 
Death Knight. Here's another one. Death Knight. I'm sure you're wondering what all of these level 10s that aren't logged into are about. Those are in preparation for the leveling guide next expansion. I needed a slew of new unlogged into 10s, and the reason I don't log into them is I don't want them collecting rested. I do not use rested when I test for leveling guides to make sure that you guys get the most out of it. Because if I do everything with every buff possible and uh, lots of rested, then, you know, someone who doesn't and wants to level from a fresh, a freshie will have different results and that just kind of ruins it in my opinion, so. Alright, we need hunters. I have a lot of hunters on this account. Alright, hold on. Hold on. A rat crept softly through the vegetation dragging its slimy belly on the bank while I was fishing in the dull canal on a winter evening round behind ah, the gas house musing upon the king Stasis. my brother's wreck and on the king my father's death before him. White bodies naked on the low damp ground and bones cast in a little low dry garret, rattled by the rat's foot only, year to year. Demonstus is subscribed to your channel for six months. Well, thank you for that uplifting and spiritual poem, Demon Stasis, and for the resub. Super appreciate your continued support, because thanks to folks like you, I can keep working. So, thank you so much! Appreciate it! There we go. Almost Hunter. I have a lot of Hunters on this account. That's kind of insane. Leveling your fishing? Nice! Good luck on fishing. I struggle with fishing, man. I'm so glad I'm done for a while. I have... Where is that all of them? Yeah. Fishing is painful for me. Alright, so we have Palu. We need Reese. Where's Reese? I am missing one. Where... Where other hunter? Reese? Wait, am I blind? There he is. He blended in. All right, Paulo, Reese, uh, Baltimore. Uh, Kaboa. Uh, Macarita. Uh, Thaloon. Uh, Coravin. Mondoili. All right. And we need a sh -sh shamans. We need a Vicini. We need Zagreus. Oh, hold on. Come on. Um. Dodriel, where is he at? He's down here, because he's a newbie. There we go. Okay. We need Boia. Shaman and Evoker is Druid. Safra. And we need. Hold on, I will check out chat again here in a minute. I need another Druid in this county. I only have two. Interesting. Alright, uh, Star of Vinny. We need Rogues. Where's Rogue Targa? Where's Kunal? Okay, after rogues is monk. So monk. 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 And those go Nimi, Vanessa, Thalaru. Alright. Now we need Demon Hunter. So Craven. There's Grim, there's Grim. Okay. Uh, mages, we need den. We need Hukmoji. We need Jandrit. Where's she at? There's she right there. Perfect. Okay. Now we need mage priest. So we need Majet Hapoa. 
the Sokka needs to be in the between. And then it's Warlocks, which is Matuzer, Shalomarill, and Javrak. There we go. This account is now in order. Alright, I can actually look at, at chat again. Apologies, everybody. I gotta make sure I do that correctly, or I will absolutely um, not order them right. <laughs> Alright, where are we at here? Uh, now that raw gold has been buffed, do you think your raw gold guides are up to date, or would you update them? They're probably not up to date. I would love them to be. I don't plan to re-update them uh, unless there is another major gold sink that's a limited time. And I don't consider the gold sink coming to be a limited time one because it's a profession one. That's not going anywhere unless they say otherwise. So they probably won't be updated anytime soon. I would love if they were uh, like just magically matching, but I doubt it. Dusty Bottoms 58 subscribed to your channel for nine months. Thank you so much for the resub, Dusty Bottoms. Super appreciate your continued support. Because thanks to folks like you, I can keep working. So thank you so much. Appreciate it. Okay, where are we at here? Uh, let me catch up with the chat real quick. Leveling fishing, awesome. Uh, do you do content streaming full time? Uh, I think it's technically full time. I do. Streaming four days a week for four hours each day. I don't know if that would be considered full-time or not, unless you consider only 40 hours a week full-time. But if I was actually focusing on my YouTube channel, that would eat up the rest of my time. So technically, yes, I'm just in a bit of a break right now. Question, do you do RBGs with viewers? No, I haven't done RBGs since Legion, and I don't plan to ever do any again. I can't stand PvP. <laughs> but thank you for asking, Focused. I am a... Right, it's not working very well. Non-competitive player only. I retired from all that back in BFA. Alright, let me fix my bags here. New bags, who dis? That, we need 34 here. UI spacing. Team. 50 some. That, that, icons, that and that, we want 44, and auto open everywhere but those three. Okay, uh, and I need to fix mask. There we go. Mascarino is down here, skin, Baganator, we want modern enhanced. There we go. Turn those off. Much better. Oh, I didn't turn off the uh, sort feature. Let's turn that button off. Where was that again? Oh, I can never remember that one. Ah. Sort button bad. Make Angie. All right. Uh, back, and I have usually always gotten my fishing done ASAP, but I still can't bring myself to finish the second half of the long haul when my shadow ends fishing. <laughs> Completely understandable. Yeah, fishing can be a bit of a drag unless you really enjoy it, so I get it. I totally get it. A lot of hunters. Yes, a lot of hunters on that particular account. Fishing equals better fishing add-on. <laughs> Fair. I'd rather do anything else. I still need to grind out a good handful of those Earth Mortis amounts. So slow and stupid hornet specific things won't drop. I'm not paying 30k per. Aw, I feel that though. Anyone know of a good resource on Void Elf naming conventions? Uh, I have been trying Fantasy Name Generator and it's okay for the moment, but just looking for more options. That was gonna be the one I was gonna recommend for you, so I don't have any other sources, I'm afraid. Where am I going? Over here. I uh, started asking ChatGPT for help on names, but it's pretty mediocre. <laughs> That's a good way to use it. It's funny. There we go. I will never get my kitty PvP focus uh, forms done. I'm sorry, focus, but you don't have to do RB RBG, so that's... Unless you're talking about uh, the Mage Tower RBG spin skin specifically. But it definitely won't be for me. I'm probably never stepping into an RBG again, so can't stand them, honestly. 
I wonder if Blizzard would add a PvE way to do PvP content, like how Comstock works, but more challenging. There technically already is. Um, if you do the open world quests, those will give you honor. You can even... Um, there's various things like that you can do in the open world. You could farm, like, the chests that drop every 45 minutes in newer expansions. Those give honor. Uh, there are ways. There are ways. Yeah, once you hit a certain age and those reflexes start slowing down, PvP becomes a lot less fun. Yeah, and it, for me, it's a competitive thing. I don't have, like, a competitive bone in my body. It's always turned me off. And because of that, I struggle in things like PvP. Like, I got good at it for a while, but then I lose interest very quick. So I'm like, oh, I don't really care. I don't really care if that guy wins or not. I just want my mount. That's the only reason I'm here. I don't play it for PvP when I was doing it. I played it for the collectibles, <laughs> which is not a good reason. So, you know. Uh, you mean you need more honor level? You can spam run Comstomp Brawl when that's up. That's true. That's another way. That's another way to do it. That is fair, which but I forgot about Comstomp. That's a good way to get uh, honor level. Uh, oh, but yeah, they're adding a solo option for queuing rated BGs and we're within. They are indeed, but it's still PvP. It's not like. You still get put into a team. It's not. Uh, it's just like regular BGs except rated. So it's gonna be interesting. <laughs> uh, they're still there. They are still there, yes. PvP towers from Legion are still active. They give less. Uh, honor now, but they do still give honor. Fantasy name generators is extremely helpful for naming characters, in my opinion. If you go under pop culture section, you can find World of Warcraft names based on each race. Nice. Yeah, that one's a good one, a good handy one if you don't like coming up with your own. Right, open that up. A certain age, some of us were born with bad flea reflexes. <laughs> Mikey Games followed your channel. Thank you so much, Mikey Games, for the follow. Glad to have you here, and I hope you enjoy your stay. I was just about to get to your question. No. <laughs> Warband Banks, I don't believe, are available yet. And man, people must be really excited for Warband Banks. That's the question I keep getting about Warbands. Which, ironically, is the feature I'm least excited about. <laughs> I could probably care less about the Warband Bank. If it was an actually account-wide bank where you could just put whatever you want in it, including BOP stuff that are not warbound, I would be a lot more excited. But it's not that, so it's just account bound stuff and like materials and things, which I won't really use much to be honest, so you know. Kind of funny that. Void Elf Girly now and a Gnome Girly. Nice! Good, good choice, good choice. I'm trying to move recipes and things from one realm to my main realm. It's the only reason. Ah, that makes sense. I got you. That makes sense. Yeah, they disabled... really hate that that's undone. I literally paid for that the other day. <clears throat> that makes me mad. They, um... Yeah, they disabled cross-realm trading. The cross-realm guild banky thing isn't working. And the cross... Well, the warband bank is also not working, so... Something cross-realm is broken, but they are fixing on it. They are working on it. Uh, I would just keep Wowhead open. Your tabs, guys, can refresh it. They'll be good at reporting on the warband uh, being available. They will. They definitely will. You guys will probably know before I will as well. I'm pretty on the ball with that. Uh, are you using a camera add-on? Why does it look so fluid? I am indeed using a camera add-on. It's called Dynamic Cam. It's very complex, but I definitely... Where am I going? Right. So near. But I definitely recommend it if you like it. There we go. Under all of this crap. There we are. Do my mice make little squeaky noises? They do. They squeak. That makes me very happy. I didn't know they squeaked when you click on them. 
No. That makes me happy. All right. Uh, she in the guild she is. I can at least dump my goal, right? Yes. It'll let me kinda do that. It's struggling. It's struggling. Yeah, I'm still obsessed with those mice as pets, right? They're so freaking cute. Make me happy. Some days I wish I didn't grow up a farm kid because I have this innate disdain for rodents, even domesticated and cartoonish. Uh, see, I'm the opposite. I also grew up as a farm kid, but I think... I always figured because of that I love rodents. <laughs> they're so cute. They may be pests, but boy are they adorable. Uh, especially when they you would open the grain barrels and they'd be in your grain. You're like, well... I get it. But now you have to die. So you just put the cat in the barrel and close the lid with the mice. <laughs> Snack. Cats love it. It's pretty funny. No more mice. Ah, well, my dad, when I was four years old, had me wearing gum boots and removing nice ma mice nests. What? Oh, that's terrible. No. And yeah, we just trapped ours, or we had a lot of cats. Uh, we still do. Very good mousers, so. Most of our issues hasn't even been from mice. It's mostly been from squirrels. Freaking ground squirrels. But now that we have more cats, there's been less ground squirrels. <laughs> They've even been going after the gophers. I was like, damn, that's some courage. Those guys are feisty. Gotta get the cats. Exactly. Little kitty meow meows. They're cute and snuggly and do their job really well. Alright. At least I don't feel bad about not locking pigeons. They shit everywhere. <laughs> Fair. Uh, which pigeons are so pretty, but man. Acid pigeon crap is uh, very destructive. It's literal acid rain. Which is really unfortunate. Because they're so cute. Little poof balls. Girls are so bad. More than once they have chewed through our window screens. Right? I've never had them come through the window screens. But I have had them chew through pipes? Wires? And I'm like, are you okay? Are you like malnutritioned or something? Like, that's so weird. They are aggressive little things. <laughs> Very cute, but boy. I think I love how Druid plays even more with War Within. It's forcing me to cat form, and cat form slaps his restoration, Druid. Nice! Well, that's good. Glad to hear that. Is Warbands finally working? Uh, depending on what part you're asking about. The only part about Warbands that didn't work on day one was the currency was slightly borked and the Warband bank. So if it's either of those, the only thing not working is the bank. But I've been doing Warband stuff yesterday and today and it's been going pretty good. Yes, but actually no. <laughs> Depends on what part you're asking about. Warbands have been fine for me. Let's see. Okay, that's that. Nice. That character. All right, Micarita. Here we go. <sighs> Next character. Just checked here on EU. It says the bank is being used by another member of your war band. So that's a no on EU. Oh, you're referring specifically to the war band bank. Got you. Yeah, war band, the term encompasses reputation, currency, achievements. So that's why I was asking if you were what you were referring to. What part of it. But the bank itself, no. Eja, please, I beg, update the add-on. I miss all the fancy numbers when I press C. Same, Septia. I ended up deleting that one a while back because I think they abandoned it. It stopped working and it got a little old, so I, I got kind of tired of it. When I lived in Winnipeg for about two years, 
One year, each separated by a number of seven or eight years, the elm squirrels were so huge I mistook them for toy-sized dogs because they were literally chasing cats up and down the streets in the neighborhood areas. That's some big squirrels. Oh, I'm not surprised though. Like some of those gray squirrels can get freaking huge. They get big. Big boys. But yeah, creature, if you want to see all the things that came in with warbands today, or, well, yesterday, technically, war bands, everything in that, if I could spell, not war bands, everything in that list is here and working except for the bank, the warband bank, or the war bank, as it's being shortened to, which I do appreciate, because that's a lot easier to say. So the war bank is not working. Crossrealm guilds are also a little borked, but again, I think that's related to the uh, the Warband Bank. Warabands sounds like something Mario would print. Warabands! Exactly. Oh, uh, that's funny. Okay, next character. Hmm. Getting these all cleaned up. Also, y'all hydrate. Water is good for you. Drink your water. Alright, so this is a count. This is seven, right? Yeah. So we're almost done, and we can get on to some other things. This doesn't take too long if I can actually focus on it. Oh, the most annoying thing to me was the Azerite armor I collected to be super fast on my level 70 druid, and I couldn't choose any traits. Oh no! That's annoying. Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't dealt with Azerite gear since... Well, BFA, actually. Alright, that guy's good. What's my favorite profession? Uh, I'm not really super into professions, but I guess if I had to pick one, I would do probably engineering because it's the most useful. You can craft tinkers that do like uh, speed boosts, gliders, um, toys that do portals, practically a mage, uh, useful things like that. So probably engineering, I go with that. Are you using a bag add-on to show your banks as one big bag? I am a D, it's called Baganator. LUI has another update? Noise. Vita noise. Good to new. We'll pop open that. Thanks for letting me know. Excellent. I wonder what they're fixing now. <laughs> it's been working fine for me, so they keep fixing little stuff. Uh, I don't see any update on mine. I might have already updated it this morning, because I saw an update this morning. Hmm. Got really lucky with the drops, too, and I was like, neat. It didn't take long. Uh, at all to make speed during this time? Oh, okay, I guess not. <laughs> Rip. That's a bummer. Engineering master profession. My meme and my guild for pushing engineering on everyone. <laughs> yes, it is really handy. It really is handy. Did Silver fall sheep? She's awfully quiet. Well, it's because I'm talking to you guys, not her. She's still here, I think. Maybe. I don't know. She's not required to be here. It's not like I'm paying her, so... <laughs> She's in and out. She might have gone to get food or something. But nah, since we're not doing anything together, she's not always here. If I could be have her be my official actual co-host, I would. But I can barely afford to pay myself, so, you know. Okay. Either that or she's tuning me out. She does that sometimes, too. <laughs> also possible. Okay, that's good. Dare she not be here 24 7 without being paid. <laughs> exactly! Uh, and you're only seeing her as much as you are right now because she doesn't have much, doesn't have a job at the moment. But as soon as she gets another job, you won't be seeing her anymore. <laughs> so, uh, enjoy her while you got her. Uh, 
When I got when I heard the BFA SL stuff got a lot harder with this patch, I got curious. I wonder if Heroic Visions also spiked. When I first came back to the game, I was gone from Argus Legion patch released at the final rate of SL. Oh, you skipped a lot. I ground out all of BFA, even Pathfinder, even before uh, even I started the SL campaign. Visions were not just not fun, relatively easy even. With all mass activated, I just dreaded it. My cloak, though. Yeah, visions were definitely hard. Um, they were. I did them when they were current. They were definitely a struggle. Silver failing her contractual obligation of entertaining us. Yes. Hikes up old man pants. I do love me some engineering. Yeah. <laughs> I did the, the old man sound for you. I took it back in vanilla to make my ammo. It never changed since. Nice. It's definitely a handy one. That's for sure. Uh, does Warbands extend across accounts? It does indeed. Warband ex it covers your entire Battle.net account. So you can have up to eight WoW accounts on a single Battle.net. And Warband is just the new term for Battle.net account wide. So it's the whole thing. All eight accounts. All... Let's see, you can have 65 characters uh, per account right now. Come on, calculator, open. 65 times 8, so that would be all 520 characters if you had them. If you had that many. <laughs> uh. How many characters do you have, Lottie? Sorry if you mentioned it before, just curious. Somewhere around 300. I can look right now at the bottom of my spreadsheet if you want. Keep in mind that this does include a good handful of unlogged into level 10s because I made a new swath of characters to uh, for the leveling testing. Uh, is that accurate? Let me double check with the race class. Yes. I have 352 it looks like. Unfortunately 32 of those are from Remix alone and I'm really mad about that to be honest. I'm not happy that it made me make so many alts. All right, he's good. Wait, she she thinks she's allowed to get a job and leave? Rude. <laughs> right, exactly. Uh, we'll log into. You can still do visions, yeah? Yep, you can. You still have to farm the currency to get the keys to get in, but you can still do them. You can, but I don't recommend it unless you're missing stuff. Yeah, exactly. I have four accounts, but I only keep two active. The two unactive ones have been helpful with RAF. Yeah, I have all eight accounts. But I tend to only keep one or two active. Oh, okay. So I hadn't logged into this character before. Create a what? Sure. Um, I have all eight accounts, but I tend to only have one or two active at any time unless I'm farming something. And Remix was the thing I was farming. So I have all eight active right now. The one that I just got off of expires in two hours. So all my other seven accounts expire soon. So I won't be using those so much anymore because I don't need them at the moment. So yeah, they don't stay active. My main account is always active. I only have one. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. Can't imagine having multiple accounts. Depends on what you like to do. If you're a major collector, having multiple accounts is really handy. Especially when it comes to stuff, not just for extra characters, but stuff like you need multiple players for. Uh, you know, as long as it's not current content, you can kind of just multi-box stuff. It's really handy. Handy dandy. Air, like choking my water, good grief. Welcome. Welcome. Whoa. My dialogue got turned on on this account. Why did my dialogue get turned back on? I need to turn it back off. That's weird. I'd be scared of the financial aspect of having multiple accounts, to be honest. Luckily, you can pay for them with gold and RAF time, which is how most of my 
Most of mine get paid for, to be honest. Gold and RAF. Sometimes I have to pay for them with actual subs if, like, I just don't have either on hand. But usually I'm, I'm pretty good and I have both, so. Recruit a friend. If you have recruit a friend accounts, um, they feed the recruit a friend system. And every, was it 30 days or something? You get uh, free game time. If you want to see how to set that up, check that out. Do I not have my RIF guide anymore? I know it still works too, I just used it recently. Well, hold your ponies, I'll get you my old RIF guide. And I can confirm it still works, I just used it to do, uh, to get some of the new RIF stuff. Uh, hold on. I thought I had an RIF link. Well, well, well. Said the well inspector to the well. Stream elements, uh, my channel, my videos. Let me look. Recruit. If I can spell. That is not how you spell recruit. Hold on. Recruit. There we go. Not recatoot. I don't know what a rectitude is, but that ain't it. All right, stream elements. Give me a chatbot. I swear I had one. Is this not working or something? Uh, to do arc gold v two gold DMF. No, I don't see it. Well, I'm gonna have one now. RF. I get you that link. Hold on. Da, 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 da. Whoop. Activate. There. Here you go. There you go. That'll do it. If you're interested in setting up recruiter friend accounts, uh, you can do it with yourself. That's how I did it. And it still works, can confirm, I just did it recently. Good way to get free game time. Takes a little bit of setup, but you know. Uh, my main is on the 12 month sub, my second account is by month, so if I need the extra 15 for the month I can cancel it. Yeah, pretty much like how I have mine. I have my other seven accounts on pause, and then I'll just feed them like gold or RAF game time, unless I need to physically sub them and then I'll unpause it and then repause it when I'm done. So it works pretty good. I like that new pause feature that they have. Even current content, I used a gear character on each account to solo Dio, so I grabbed Quantum Piece on all level 70 of my characters each week. That's hardcore! Congrats! A lot more hardcore than me, that's for sure. Royal Air Force. <laughs> Recruit a friend! I will not hold your ponies, they are too heavy! <laughs> I see what you did there. Royal Air Force, <laughs> you have to shoot down enemy planes over the British Channel, but you get free game time. <laughs> nice. Uh, you'll crack and you like to RP a lot, so I'm guessing you've read a lot of books. What are some of your favorite books and series? Well, this is going to sound a little cliche, but one of my favorites is the World of Warcraft series. Oh, generally it's Warcraft, I guess. I've read all of those. Um, the R.I. Salvatore... Sarvat I never say his name right. R.I. Salvatore series, uh, Legend of Drizzt. I have... Almost all of those. Um, I haven't read books in a while, to be honest. I like all the Witcher's ones. Um, I'd have to think about it. I'm mostly a manga reader in in anymore if I do read anything, because I just don't have time like I used to. I used to read a lot, but I don't really read that much anymore. It's pretty rare. I work too much, so, you know. Uh, by the way, that level 60 warlock I started playing again yesterday, got to 70 last night without even leaving the first zone of Dragonlands. Def ramped up leveling. Nice! Very cool. Very cool, very cool. Drizzt series is so fantastic. Love the Cleric Quintet too from uh, Salvatore. Yes, all of his books are great. He's one of my favorite authors. And actually he's one of the ones that inspired me to want to be an author. And I have three quarters of a written book that I'll probably never finish. I had a whole series planned out and everything, but 
<laughs> it was gonna be a fantasy. But alas, I don't have time, I don't have the money, and I don't have the patience. So that probably won't happen. So I get my creative desire out by just RPing. I don't know why, but even though I know RAF is recruiter friend, I keep uh, having RC, RCAF, Royal Canadian Air Force, pop up in my head. Miss that show. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. I'm the same. I read all the Drizzt books when I was younger and loved those, but now I don't really read that often. And instead of manga, I'm just a weeb and watch anime. <laughs> I feel that, yeah, I just, I don't have time anymore. I got too much adult going on, you know? Like, I've always had multiple jobs at a time to try to make ends meet. I've always had a side gig. And then, like, my hobby after I started college back in 13 became WoW. Because, ironically, when I was deciding whether or not to continue WoW, as much as I didn't like MOP back in uh, 13, uh, when MOP was in its last year, I hated the expansion. I did not have a great time. Ironically, that was also when prices for console gaming was starting to really spike. Because I'm normally a console gamer if I had to pick. But I actually stuck with WoW because it was more cost-effective than buying a new game every so often because it's like 60 bucks, 70 bucks, 80 bucks, and then a new freaking console versus buying a new expansion every couple of years and paying for a sub, which I can also now pay with gold. So ironically, I originally stayed because it was more cost-effective while I was in college because I was broke. Working two jobs and still broke. So that's that's a, there. There you go. There's a little in backstory on me there. I was in a similar situation, Lottie. I own a ton of books, many on Kindle and mostly fantasy. But I have way too many distractions to read as much as I'd like. So many great fantasy books I'd like to read, but alas. Yep, exactly. And for me, it's kind of I'm kind of at the point where like if I can't make money with this, I don't have time for it anymore. Because I. I, I gotta put. I gotta pay, pay, my, pay my bills, you know. It's frustrating. I can't make money reading a book. <sighs> Joys of being an adult, am I right? Uh, that looks good. There we go. Anyone else remember Dragon Riders of Pern? Nobody. I loved that series. Was more engaging for me than Dragonlance and other books. I never read those myself, but I had a friend that did, and she really loved them. So. I wonder how many people have gotten into WoW who read the first of uh, the Warcraft books first. That would be me. I'm definitely one of them. I had all the books. I was a lover of Warcraft itself before I ever got into the MMO. Um, I did not ever actually want to play the MMO because I don't like MMOs. <laughs> Ironically. I'm very much a solo player, if you couldn't tell. Solo duo, you know. Basically solo. So it was me. I played the RTSs, Warcraft 2 and 3, and I loved them. I loved the books. I had those. I uh, read those pretty religiously. <laughs> really enjoyed them. So I'm one of those. Uh, Game of Thrones book readers, I assume, are making good money on YouTube talking conspiracy theories. <laughs> Probably. Probably. I never did finish those ones. I got through either the first one and halfway through the second one, or halfway through the first one. I don't remember when I stopped. I didn't actually care for it. I didn't really like the uh, style of jumping around between characters each chapter. Which is weird, because no, you would think that would fit my style, and I thought it would too. But I kept it kept like detaching me from the story. Because it took me most of the chapter to try to get invested. I don't know. It was weird. So I just I didn't keep up with it. For whatever reason. Hello, Flop. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Welcome. Uh, Anne McCaffrey. I loved them as well as her sci-fi stuff. Anne McCaffrey has an obsession with food. <laughs> MMOs kind of suck if you aren't playing with good friends. Yeah, agreed. And I didn't really play with good friends literally until I met Silver in 2017. And then when she went away, I played with Canary for a while after that. Um, then Canary got too busy. Welcome back, Silver. Thank you. Apologies. I got... I got napped. <laughs> All good. <laughs> I figured. Everyone's like, where's Silver? 
I told them not to get too comfy with you being here, because as soon as you get a job, they won't be seeing you anymore. No. Very, very... Very seldom. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Here we go. Uh, yeah, same. And if you're like me, once I've gotten the more important things done, by the time I sit down to read, I usually fall asleep right after a few pages. Same. I, by that point, I'm too tired. And so instead of, like, reading to go to sleep, um, because that's kind of hard in my eyes, and I have to, like, physically turn off a light or something. I don't like using Kindles. Yes, I realize I could use a Kindle or something. I don't like electronic books. <laughs> I like the physical. I'm, I'm old, I guess. But because of that, I'm too tired to read it. So I just play something on my Switch until I fall asleep, since it's, it auto shuts off after a while. Save the battery. Um, so Animal Crossing, Pokemon, Stardew Valley, something chill that my brain can focus on and not think about the other problems I have going on in the real world. And then uh, I'll just fall asleep. Then I'll wake up with the switch on my face. So, you know. <laughs> it works out. Doing fine? Good. Glad to hear it, Flop. Glad to hear it. Love the Wheel of Time book series on Amazon kind of right off. And people who used to care we, uh, compare Wheel of Time to Game of Thrones often, so I tried to get into Game of Thrones, but found George R. R. Martin's writing style just be incredibly crude and crass, like some sort of real man's writing his own fanfic. Couldn't get into them. Ah, completely understandable. Yep, everyone's got their styles and their flavors, and sometimes they just don't mesh. I get it. Sin says, welcome back, Silver. Oh, thank you. I was right, she did fall asleep. No, not that kind of nap. She got, like, kidnapped by her dad or mom or something. Yeah. I got, I got kidnapped by dad. Dad napped. Yeah. <laughs> he needed help. He's getting issues. Aw. Did you solve his help need? I did. He needed help carrying stuff down from up here. Ah, perfect. Yep. Uh. Well, I mean, it's kind of accurate. It really is. <laughs> My mom was big into Pern, uh, but as a kid, I was big into D&D &D at the time. Uh, D-Lance was out, I have to say, heretic. Uh, uh, moved. Where'd it go? I'm actually meeting Margaret, uh, I'm probably saying this wrong, Vice? Weiss? At Gen Con next week. Nice! That's awesome. I've always wanted to meet some of my favorite authors, like Salvatore or uh, Christy Golden. She's another one. Or Richard Knack. But I feel like it would be really awkward and I'd just be like, Hi, you're really cool. I love your books. Bye. Like, <laughs> I wouldn't have anything meaningful to say to them. I'm not really like the meet your heroes person, to be honest. So, eh. You know. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, creature said, and we said you were rude to think you could just get a job and leave. <laughs> yes. They don't want you to get a job and leave. <laughs> Listen, if I could swing it and just be here all the time and not have to pay for WoW or necessities, I like snacks, I would. <laughs> right. Exactly. That's what I was telling them. If I could afford to pay you, I would actually hire you, hire you as my co-host. And this would be the, the Kraken and Silver show, but alas. Alright, that one's done. Alright, that's gonna switch to my another account, isn't it? Yep, it does that. Alright, hold on. Got on the last account here. Is that one, is that still syncing? It is, it's still syncing. Alright. I really wish... It's my one complaint about this. It doesn't like switching to the active window. Switch to the other window, please. Rawr. No. Refresh. There we go. I see. I see. I have to disable it, re-enable it, and refresh it, and then I don't have to log out of my other accounts. Beautiful. Got it. All right, where are we at here? Uh, da, 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 da. Hi, Kraken. How are you? I'm doing good, Tone. Glad to have you here. How are you doing? Welcome. 
One thing I don't like about the new login screen is you can't search characters or sort them by realm. I made too many characters with the same names on different realms. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that. You couldn't search by realm, which I thought was odd. So, you know. Now, my daughter is the same way. She much prefers physical books, just prefers the physical turning of pages. I do too. I do too. I I don't know. Something about the reading, trying to read an ebook or something online, if it's not super short, I get. I don't not invested somehow it doesn't feel like it's interesting even though I could read the same thing in a physical book and I'd probably like it I don't know, I don't know man uh, well she is her dad's kid so yeah kidnapped <laughs> makes sense uh, okay I will catch up with chat in a second I need to organize this is the last account I need to organize the character list here because this one is all borked as well so give me just a second and then I will pay attention to you lovelies let's see girl list Rutherford. actually somewhat correct on this one it's close where's my other paladin I have four on this one yeah, it's because he's new. There we go. Okay, his sword is invisible. That's funny. Alright, um, so we need warriors. Where's the warriors? There's one. Uh, two. And... There's three. Organize that. Okay, so we need Glynn, Sorvo, and Mordnet. Okay, they're good. Uh, Death Knights. We need Death Knights. We need Hoth first. Oh, Silver, you should check out Hoth's new log. If you want to look oh. at the screen real quick. Once it Man, switches see. over. Ooh! You like him? Oh, I like it. Thank you. That looks really good on him. I know. I'm like, mm, kind of tempted to do something with him. I don't know. He looks like a dragon. He does look like a dragon. That would look really good on the Evo. You know, if they could wear armor. Yeah, if they could wear plate. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Alright. Uh, I need Zotahan. Where's he at? There he is. Question. Yes. What do you see? What do you see Shao being? Race-wise. Yeah. Race-wise? Hmm. Shall... And he's a monk. Probably a human, to be completely honest. Just because he feels too, like, stoic and beefy to be your, like, any sort of elf. I can see it. Alright. See you, Lou. Now we need hunters. Hunter. Because if he was like more fluid and pretty, I'd probably say like Drakthir or maybe Nightborn or Night Elf, but he's not the flowy pretty sort. He's really not. He's grumpy. Yep. So, human. <laughs> uh, let me grab all my hunters here. Apologies, everybody. I know chat. I see it's working. Moving over there in the, my peripheral. I will attend to you lovelies momentarily. Getting my guys all done here. I, I don't know why it, it totally scrambled them. <laughs> and most of these were on the same account, so it's not like it was because it was merging mult or uh, same realm, I mean. Not because not it was molding. Well, I give up. Start over. Recomputing. <laughs> -na -na -na. Good grief. The, the pink, the or, pink color for humans is so bright. It is overwhelmingly bright, isn't it? I love it. I love it so much. I love the pink hair. Oh, that's monk. I need hunter. So many hunters on this account. Okay. Now I can organize them. Cavall at the top. Uh, Drake's is second. Uh, Brent. Third, 
Rathrium is fourth. Uh, Rolleros. And then we need Bekshi. Um, Milande is not up here. Where's Milande? Where's Milande? Am I blind? Probably. Oh, she's up here. Milande is after Bekshi. And then we need Dusu. All right, shamans. We need shaman lam lam lams. So shamans, let's go gather our shamis. <laughs> shamans. Okay, uh, Parthos, Nui, and Mimoji. Okay. And we need our evokers, Malachus and Talantos. And they're right there. Okay. Druids. We did the crackle on stream slap. I needed water, alright. <laughs> Those are hydrate. It's the crackle. The crackle hydrate? The crackle hydrate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. I hydrated. Oh, there we go. Um. Ruskin Godel and Az. Ruskin Godel and Az is the one account that doesn't have a horde druid. I need to fix that at some point. Ah, uh, now we need rogues. Okay, let's grab our rogies. Rogue. 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 Okay, so we need Cadrian. We need. Airy. We need Barrow. And down. Okay. Barrow. Oh, he's pretty. You like Barrow? Yeah, he's cute. I do. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, I know he's monks. I was about to be so mad. Why? Shallon was taken. Shallon was taken by me. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Find them. I could only find the moon guard version. I was like, where is he? That's funny. I found him. It's he fine. Nice Sato. Totally, told you I still had him. He's just on eight. Be there. Uh, let's see. Oath Karn. I need. Where's Shay? There she is. Shay and Jerry. Oh, yep. There he is. There he is. I love Sato. I don't know why. I just. I get good vibes from him. Happy vibes. It's funny because he's not a good vibe, happy vibe guy. <laughs> I know! <laughs> he's a grumpy old jerk. And I love him for it. You like my grumpy old man characters. I do! <laughs> if I play anything really well in RP, apparently it's a grumpy old man. There we go. Rose, Sedina, and Shalar. And then we need just for. Abacus and Dramura. Okay. Organized. I can stop ignoring all of you. I'm sorry. I love you. There. Okay. Alright. What are we all talking about here? Uh, let's see. Is there anything I need to answer? A lot of chat about Game of Thrones, it looks like. Dude. Creature says, I figured out a solution for you, Silver. Since you work with an old god, you don't need puny human snacks. <laughs> <laughs> but I need them. Yes. The sugary, bad for you, but tastes delicious. <laughs> exactly. 
Wish we could just get a whole graphic Snapchat of all your alts together. <laughs> that would be... Well, I have 350-something of them, according to my list, so... That'd be a lot. That'd be a very... Your favorites. It'd be like a Pokemon chart at that point. Oh, I gotta fix my bags on this one, right? <sighs> That's new. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Let me fix bags real quick. Uh, 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 fixing my bags, fixing my bags. 34? Who are you tip tapping? I am tip tapping in my spreadsheet. No. Oh, because you're getting more, uh, leveling alts from me. Excellent. Borders, icons, uh, these, need 44, and then auto open all but those three. And turn off the sort button, because that's evil. Oh, and mask. Have you finished syncing yet? I think it has. That's good. Uh, hold on, almost done. Mask. Muscle, Aginator, Modern. There we go! Now we're good. Alright, now I can look at it. Once again, greatly offended that cracking is ignoring us. <laughs> I see how it is. Is Hunter my favorite class? It is not, actually. Well, it's one of my top five, I guess. It's just really easy to use for leveling uh, testing. So, I have a lot. Once you get a new PC, playing WoW feels so amazing. I've only played WoW in graphics settings level 2 for so long. Oh no! Well, congrats on your new computer. And being able to see the world. It's beautiful. I feel that. That was me. <laughs> yes. There we go. Okay, now I can get back in the rhythm of uh, getting on. Looking and getting off. Okay. Alright. And I think that account finished so I can comfortably log out of it. There we go. Alright, let's see. Let's see, take a looky. Beth says hi, Kraken and Silver. This is where you say hi. Silver. Hi. <laughs> uh. Who said it? Who said hi? Beth. Oh, hi Beth. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> uh, let's see, guys, we're talking about. If you were to recommend a server for gold making on Horde now, which would it be? I know you should avoid student server, like student server, but I don't know which one that is. Not a clue. That would be a question for chat because I don't do any specific gold making, like purposely per se. So I don't know. Uh, let's see. Go. All right. Here we go. What's a good add-on that you use for loot toasts? I'm getting back into farming old content since you can collect almost everything on one tune now, and the bombardment of toasts is annoying. Uh, the only add-on I use, I guess, that does that is LVY. Technically, it does its own loot toasts. But I don't look at them 90% of the time. It's not really something I care about. So I I don't really have a good recommendation on that. I'm sorry. Did you finish all remix and logs? Unfortunately, no. I only got... Uh, I did everything except for scenarios and normal heroic and mythic raids. But everything else is completely done. So. Student is on AD. Argent Dawn? Well, there you go. Perfect. Very happy just for reading the books instead of watching the shows uh, that butcher the source material. I don't even like the Lord of the Rings that movies that much. We can't be friends. Get out of here. The movies are better than the books. Fight me. Fight. 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 <laughs> uh, there we go. There we go. Okay. And this. All right. <clears throat> I'm 
Next character, here we go. Back into it. Food fight! <laughs> exactly! Fight, fight, fight! There are a few things I disagree with Peter Jackson on, but I think he mostly got it right. Ironically, like, I like both the books and the movies, to be completely clear. I greatly enjoy both, but I actually liked the creative liberties, some of them that Peter Jackson took with the movie more than that were in the book. So, you know, just little things mostly. Here we go. Appreciate them both. That said, the books definitely aren't going to be for everyone. Yeah, those are deep dives. Those, those are, you want to get into fantasy, that is deep. Especially if you start reading the other, uh, books that are related to it, like the Silmarillion and the histories and which all of which are greatly fascinating. I love those. So there you go. Aren't there's some more books I have. Oh I like that, Silver. That's cute. You should keep that one. I am. I'm over here fixing him a little bit on his human form to match. Perfect. Who are I, you making I, exactly? I have no idea. Oh I kinda love him. It was just what came up when I clicked on Evo and I was like Wait. <laughs> New character, who it is? Do it. Make him keep him. So he knew. He knew. I love that. <laughs> Excellent. Okay. When we finish this account, which we're just starting it, it won't take that long, I think. Um, we're technically only barely two hours into the stream, so that means we can move on to other stuff. Um... So we'll do currency stuff after this, but after this account first, we'll take a short break. Normally I take a break halfway through stream, which was 11 minutes ago, but I wanted to try to make sure to get these dang accounts done, because I want to do other things. I'm tired of logging in and out. <laughs> That's kind of the bad thing, having a gazillion alts, is this. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so. We'll take a short break when this account is done, and then we can get back on my main account, which it looks like it's finished syncing now. So that's good. Um, at least with the accounts I was doing it with. Because that were about to expire and all that. We'll get some coffee. And then we'll probably do currency stuff. We started currency stuff yesterday. Um, because Blizzard said you wouldn't have to log into all your alts to register them with the warband. But there were some characters it was not picking up. So <laughs> I have to. So you do have to. They tried. I know they tried. And they got most of it. To be fair, they got a very large percentage. But considering I have so many, <laughs> I'm not surprised that it didn't properly register them also. All right. There we go. Uh, to each their own, I was forced to watch the Lord of the Ring movies when they came out instead of being able to go back to my room and play Ragnarok online slash WoW. So they've been soured. Ah, that'd definitely do it. But I haven't seen them in forever, so maybe I'd love them if I was able to rewatch them. Definitely do, and get the extended version. The extended versions are even better. I highly recommend them. You might like them more. Maybe read the book. Maybe reread the books first, and then watch the movies. And then you could get, uh, you know, a thought on it. Could be fun. I need to rewatch them again. I want to watch them with Silver at some point because she's never actually seen them. Which mm -hmm. is just blasphemy to the fantasy world. So, you know. <laughs> Same with Star Wars. We need to watch all nine or whatever it is of the Star Wars movies that exist. All the Star Wars. Including all the side shows. All of them. We need to watch all of them together. And all the Marvel movies. And all the vampire movies that I have. We're gonna watch so many movies when, if and when we move into each other. Into each other? Yeah, we're gonna move into each other. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna merge. We're gonna merge, become one that, uh, amorphous thing. Just blah, blah, blah. <laughs> When we move in together, we're gonna watch so many movies. Yes. Silver Latte, <laughs> yes. Ah. Uh. Oh, that's funny. All right, let me catch up with the chat here. Uh, if I was stuck in a desert island, deserted a deserted island, apparently, same thing, with some tech and could only pick one cinematic series, Lord of the Rings would probably be it. And if it included the Hobbit trilogy as well, then it's a no-brainer. Yes, thank you. The Hobbit trilogy was amazing. I loved it. I was thrilled. I saw those in theaters, all three of them. I was happy. And haha, <laughs> Thrandable. We already talked about him, though. <laughs> Forgive me for being stupid, but uh, what are you doing via logging to each character going to the bank that looks empty? I'm registering the bank 
and my um, void storage and my bags into the new bag add-on that I have, registering it to ATT, and it also helps the base game kind of be like, hey, this is what you have on hand because your character's recently been logged into, because some of these haven't been logged into for a couple months. So, if you don't log in every once in a while, the game's like, this character doesn't exist. <laughs> so, that's probably why it wasn't picking up some of my alts the other day. But that's why. That is why. Uh, but no, you're not stupid. All good, Mikey. It's a perfectly understandable question. You are totally fine. But sadly, my movie night friends keep coming up. Friend in movies instead of finally watching Lord of the Rings. Oh no. Are Warbanks up yet? Not that I've seen. I haven't seen the news on them. I'm sure Wowhead will be probably the first to let us know. <laughs> Whenever it is. Lord of the Rings is one of those fun thought experience for me like, what if Sean Connery had accepted to be Gandalf or other such things? Yes! Right? Could you imagine? Sean Connery as Gandalf? Like, he, I'm sure he would have done a great job. But like, having the Gandalf we have now versus other actors that could have been those characters. It's just fascinating. Alright. Is anyone else's honor bound uh, rep reset down to zero out of 6,000 friendly? I was definitely exalted. Uh oh. I don't know. Uh, that'd be... I don't even have BFA rep on this character, so I don't, I don't know. This is a fairly new character. Uh, they got all of our alts cracking. They're still working on your list of alts, apparently. <laughs> yeah. Extended is a must. There's several cutscenes that shouldn't have been cut. Agreed. Thank you, Void. Agreed. Very important. Lore-heavy ones. Emotional ones. And you're like, I get you gotta cut it down for the movies. But dude. Dude. Uh, let's see. That's in response to Ryak. I was only able to watch the original very first release. Got you. Got you. That makes sense. Silver latte, Kraken silver? Silver Kraken. <laughs> silver Kraken, there we go. All the Marvel movies take forever. They do. They really do. Silver Kraken. Kraken sounds like a shiny. We're Silver Kraken now? Yep. <laughs> Love it. Uh, wasn't expecting body horror on the Kraken latte stream today. Exactly. I know, sorry. I'm, I'm behind on chat. I'm catching up. That's such a commitment. Yes. Does that mean you'll have, we'll have 16 arms? Hmm, probably. I can see it. Mm. Just say yes. If I, had, if I had a Kraken model, maybe. But I don't. I mean, if you're merging the one. void, anything can happen. That's fair. I would love to rewatch 1 through 6. I can't send Ray and 12-year-old Rage Child. What's his name? Kylo Ren. I... I'm both ways about it. I didn't like them at first... But after re-watching them, I was like, I could get behind this. I like a lot of the side characters that are going on in the newer Star Wars movies. Because I agree with you. And I really don't think he should have taken off his helmet. Because he's got such a baby face. But, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's just that's all I'll say on that. Uh, the Hobbit trilogy was entertaining, but did not need to be a trilogy. See, I'm the opposite. I would have loved an entire bigger series. I want a whole quadrilogy. I want more. It was too short for me. I loved it. I also watched all three Hobbit movies in theater in 3D, if I remember correctly, after reading the book and really enjoyed them. Oh, then, then yeah, you would you would love the the uh, extended edition full trilogy of Lord of the Rings. I think if you liked the Hobbit ones, I think you would at least. Oh yeah, I should log into all my 70s uh, to start getting rested XP. We won't get rested XP until launch. Not until launch. After launch, yes, but not yet. Uh, let's see, yeah, 70 still max level. Thanks for the answer. What's the bag add-on? That is a baginator. Kind of like Terminator, but it's a bag. Baginator. <laughs> yeah, it's the it's the new bag bag the new bag non, if you will. Not that it's new. But it's very similar to Bagnon, and Bagnon, as much as I love it, has been limped along- Right, don't do the guild bank. It's warped. Uh, poor Bagnon has been limped along for years at this point, and I'm tired of fighting with it. And Silver actually shared a add-on with me that I liked. So, 
Hmm, that sounded condescending. That's not the way I meant it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Silver, I love you. Ouch. I meant that, Just, like... Do, she, do you see what she does to me? Yeah, don't pull... She abuses me. Don't pull the victim card, you wench. <laughs> Jeez. Don't give me that. You know I meant it positively. <laughs> I meant that I'm hard to convince to like new add-ons, because I'm very old and set in my ways. Me. You're old. Not you. <laughs> I swear. Ugh. All right, where are we at here? Uh, never saw the last Hobbit movie. Really? Oh, it was so good though. An oak and shield is so hot. Never thought I'd say that about a dwarf. Uh, like yeah, I enjoyed watching TMNT from the '90s, but they watched the second day. Uh, then they watched the second on weekday at 1 a.m. Please think of us, EU people. <laughs> Fair. I have to hand it to you, Kraken. Your mogs are on point. Thank you, Flop. I love mogging. I can't wait to do more mog runs because expect to see a lot more mog stuff in the future. I don't need to do a lot of mount farming or a lot of old achievement farming much anymore. I have a lot of that already, which I'm very happy about. So expect to see a lot of questing and mog farming and getting that new drip. Gonna look nice. Baconator, kinda yeah. Baganator. Baconator does sound pretty good, though. I could definitely go for a burger. Uh, my question is why are you not getting choked with blue arrows every time you log into a character? Uh, cause all my add-ons got updated. I think I only have like one that wasn't working. So even all the ones that I shot off yesterday, all but like one of those got updated today. So that is why. All my add-ons have been updated except for like a couple. I think I also have three sets of Lord of the Rings books, two of Hobbit, and the Silmarillion. Although I gotta say Silmarillion hurts my brain. That one is a hard one. That's that's deep, because that gets into like ancient history and lineology and like um, language stuff. And But I'm a nerd and I love that because that's hardcore world building stuff. I use that in my RP. So like, it's not for everyone. Can confirm. <laughs> It's hard core stuff. Uh, Silver actually did something useful for once. That's not how I phrased it! You take that back! <laughs> Gosh her. dang it. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. I'm gonna kick you out of my stream, you jerk. <laughs> Turning my, my viewers on me. This is my cult. I mean followers, not yours. <laughs> They're converting. No. Oh. <laughs> Rude. There we go. Baganator, yes, thank you. I kept getting the errors even when three of my mods were disabled. But disabled script errors. That's one way to do it. That definitely can help. I've been mug farming since I got home yesterday afternoon. I'm probably getting close to 100k gold from the farm just selling raid drops. Nice. Uh, I haven't had a single Lua error. Well, that's good. Yeah, it definitely depends on what add-ons you're using. I have... I found like three or four that I'm getting, but they're like to be expected because they're very old add-ons, so they're just turned off. But all my other ones are working great now, so. Uh, I hated the newer Star Wars films. Love The Mandalorian. If you noticed Ahsoka in my pick I linked earlier, you know I adore the animated Clone Wars series. Same. With the Ahsoka being my favorite character, but I hated the new Star Wars films. Writers of the new stuff just trash, trash to die lore. I do agree. Like, I'm not... When I say I was okay with them, I mean them as movies on their own, not as actual canon Star Wars, if that makes sense. As movies, I enjoyed them. But as a hardcore Star Wars fan, I agree. They totally butched the lore, and I don't appreciate it. Especially that now they apparently don't consider a lot of the old world lore, like from their old Republic and stuff, as canon. I'm like... That's where all the Sith Lords are! That's the best stuff! Get out of here! Pfft. Not in my lore. So, I agree. As movies are good, but as Star Wars movies, not really. <laughs> I just like it because sci-fi, swords, lasers, ships flying around different planets. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh...
That's good. But yeah, Mandalorian, though. Top notch. Some of the best stuff they've done in a while. Top notch. Whoever wrote that one? Ah. Give that person a raise. Silmarillion is a history textbook. It is indeed, and that's why I love it, I think. <laughs> I love the add-on Bagnator. I have it. It's better than Bagnon, in my opinion. See, I like Bagdon, which is why I didn't wasn't too fond of Bagnator at first, because it was uh, more promoted for like the categorizing and the sorting, which I don't like. But you can turn all that off, and it's just it functions the same as Bagnon. It's just one big bag, one big big bag. I can I can change the size, the color. It works with mask. There's an LVY skin for it, so it matches my LVY stuff. And I'm pretty happy, actually, because I basically made it like Bagnon, and it actually sorts my characters better in the tooltip. It actually puts them by frickin' alphabetical, which Bagnon was very bad about not doing. So that's nice. I wish I could group them by class, but that's fine. So... I can definitely agree. Whether you like the big single bag with no sorting, or hardcore sorting in categories, I like Bag and Inner. It's possibly going to be the new replacement for Bagnon. Add-ons are constantly updating too, so make sure you're always checking those. Exactly! I update every time I get on in the morning, and especially during the week, I will open it multiple times during the day um, to check for, for updates. Um, because during a patch week, I mean. Because patch weeks, all updates are constantly happening. As a doth. Aw, he cute. He's so happy. He's got the same horns as uh, the the red and white one. Mm -hmm. He could be her brother. Yeah, cute. I can see it. It's very cute. Uh, I somehow had another 13 add-on updates just now, right? <laughs> I'm also very bad with names. So every two pages I had to go back the whole and like, who's this character again? Ah, that one. To be fair, Tolkien is not great with his names. He has amazing names, but a lot of them are very samey. <laughs> so I understand. And ironically, there's even in writing, because I went to college and got degrees in script writing for entertainment, which means TV script, movie script, uh, novels. I can do all kinds of stuff like that. Um... Deciding what I'm qualified for. I don't use it, but I have it. I ended up not going that direction in my career, but... Anyway, they actually have something called the Tolkien Syndrome. <laughs> Which is when you have too many characters that are too similarly named, and it confuses your readers, and can undermine your story because no one can keep track of who's who. Because of the name, and the characters don't feel visually distinct enough to make it okay. Literally a thing I learned in college, so it's so funny that you mentioned that because it's true. It is. That's why you're struggling. Uh, that's funny. I feel that. I have that issue. No, I don't say yours is that bad though. A little, but not that bad. Aragorn son of Arathorn. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yep. You can immediately see it. Yes. Uh, Silmarillion reads like a Bible. Very, very tough to follow, at least for me. I got it. Yeah, I get it. Kind of the old school writing can be a little hard. Yeah, I leave Chris Forge up on my second monitor so I can see when updates are out. Smart, smart. After I first read Silmarillion, I was like, huh, I wonder if they could ever make a movie out of that. Probably not, to be fair. <laughs> I mean, if they did, it wouldn't be the whole book. It would probably be very specific parts of it. Like, I would love to see the ancient wars, like with all the, the elven wars. I want the history stuff. Way more interesting than some of the new stuff. Uh, I'm still bitter about Clone Wars doing the witches dirty. Aww, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, Revan and Mara Jade so many times, yes, right? Right? And that's not even just them. We got like the older Sith Lords, like the in the tombs you see on Korriban and such. Frickin' Nagasato, one of my favorites. XR Coon, right here, baby. Big fan. I'm a nerd. <laughs> Love me some Sith. I'm a villain lover, so. Gotta have a good villain in a series or it just ain't interesting. I'm way behind on chat. Wow, I'm sorry. 
By the way, is there an XP buff in pre-patch? I don't see one, so I don't think so. Uh, got drowned up before I believe, but speaking of world building, I jammed my first game. D&D game, congrats, Flop! Congrats! Yeah, sorry if I skip stuff, I'm trying to catch up. You guys are very chatty today, which I do appreciate. But I really like reading everyone's chat, so it makes it hard to keep up. Uh, apologies. Let's see, I'm also very bad with names IRL, gotcha. I can only remember the names of people who absolutely annoy the living out of me. Fair. Are there any gold farming methods that are good? I want to save as much as possible if I'm able to buy the expansion and or sub alongside it. Uh, I haven't done a lot of gold farming, so I'm not particularly sure this expansion. Like, I would have recommended the races if you have a lot of alts or the world quests in Dragonflight, but apparently the old raids, because I'm assuming because of the item level buff from what people have said, uh, the old raids have gone up in gold value. So maybe you could start farming, uh, I don't know, BRF again or something. That was my go-to. You could do it in like, what, 14 minutes flat and walk out with 10k? Well, that was back then, but can't do that now. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Before the nerf, at least. I don't know, but maybe try giving some old raids uh, a run. If you like that sort of thing. Uh, I almost went to school for the same creative writing type path, but instead chose computer science development due to, surprise, surprise, money. I feel that. Ironically, I was going to a different college for a BFA in, um, I know it's a BSA, Bachelor of Science, BOS, Bachelor of Science. BS, yeah, Bachelor of Science in game art and design. So I would have been like a world builder level designer, um, lore and tech, depending on the direction I went. Uh, but that college closed down despite being open for a hundred years. So halfway through my degree, I got screwed. So that didn't happen. I had to switch gears. So I ended up going to a writing college, called it good. Ah, so many chats! Uh, just about five or six of my Lance Hunters are the same variation of Hearn. <laughs> Understandable. I go to this place three times a week for two hours for six years now. Aside from the two main people there- oh! JPT underscore eight subscribed to your channel for one month. Thank you so much JPT8 for the sub! I super appreciate your continued support because thanks to folks like you, I can keep working. So, thank you so much! Appreciate it! Alright, I'm gonna have to start skipping some chat, I think. Unless it's questions, because... So what's the green screen effect when using a portal in the portal room? A bug! That is an error right now. That is not supposed to do that. <laughs> Love Sauron, Galadriel, Duo, and Ring so much. Oh, same! Chat, 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 plow one cookie. <laughs> yes. There we go. I have you on in the background when you said congrats, Flop. I thought you were insulting them. No, no, this is actually his name. <laughs> That's funny. No, no, no. The only people I'll actually insult are people I actually know, like Silver. I call her a wench. She's not actually a wench, unless she wants to be. That can't be for you. Hot. But not here, baby. Anyway. <laughs> 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 uh, right now, old raids are providing more gold or the DF flights. Uh, you could do them as well on any character. 1 to 10. 10 to 70, yeah. <laughs> 10 to 70. One night hold run is like 3k. Nice. Hello, Blick. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Welcome. 500 G per character for a race on average. If you do a lot of characters, those dragon riding races add up quick. Yeah, that's uh, that would have been my first recommendation. I had a, a video on that at the start of the expansion. Um, but there ended up not being re a real... I mean, there was kind of a gold sink, but it wasn't, like, nearly as expensive as past gold sinks we've had. Which, speaking of, that is still around. If all of you haven't um, finished getting all of the current FOMO gold sink stuff that you want... It goes away in August. We do still have time. 
I think it's like roughly two mil to get all of it, but it's like multiple pieces so you can do it in, in sections. You don't have to do it all at once. Um, so, just as a reminder. Uh, also, just gathering in general will get you some passive gold. Yeah, for sure. That's just vendor trash. Yes. I'm glad. I hope it stays that way. Especially since I want to do some more mog farming. Like, I say more, but some actual mog farming. I've not really purposely mog farmed in a long time. So, looking forward to that. My degree's in computer graphics and games, but not using it. Yeah, I I'm not using it either. <laughs> Ironically, not really. I didn't go that career. I wanted to. But, uh... Thankfully, while I was going to that college that shut down, I had a internship, ironically, at Microsoft for a brief time. Let's just say there's a reason I didn't go into that career. And we'll leave it at that. Uh, let's see. Uh, as in gear and junk and stuff? Yes! That's excellent. Yeah, I knew what you mean. All raw gold stuff, all the vendor trash. Beautiful. Not just the portal room, mage portals do the same green screen thing. I saw, I've been seeing some screenshots of it. It's kind of insane. They must be updating the spell effect on them or something. Ah, uh, Moonguard RP. <laughs> Definitely. Okay, I think I'm actually catching up to chat. Wow. You guys are putting me through the through my, through the ringer today. Hmm. I'm out of water. Good thing I'm almost done with this account. Hello, Data Bob. How you doing? Welcome. Also, the DF races is good for passive leveling right now. They give a little over 10% a level per one. Nice. Hopefully that stays all the way up to 70, because I know uh, pre-patch, pre when you hit like 65, it became like disgustingly low. But, uh, yeah. So hopefully that uh, stays. Races give average 4K two times a week, uh, doing 19 tunes. Yes, it's delicious. That is, uh, if you, um, where are you at? If you remember to do, um, all of them, because you can actually do all of them except for the Forbidden Reach, even as low as level 60. So, I don't know if you can do them before level 10 now, but, or before level 60, I mean, but the, uh, Races, you can do, you can fly down and do Zerlock even if you're low level. You can go into the Emerald Dream, not through the portal. But if you have engineering, you don't have to upgrade it because the toy automatically gives you the random one that you have to upgrade for the specific spots, but also an Emerald Dream portal by default with unleveled engineering and Dragonflight. So you can take that to the Emerald Dream and go do the races there. The only ones that won't show up are the Forbidden Reach ones. So, you can get a lot. It's pretty great. If you want to do that. It requires a lot of alts to really get anywhere with it. So. I'm torn. Thankful for uh, AI as it's made my job a thousand times easier. But at the same time, we see the writing on the wall. So I've been migrating away from development. More towards AI. Yeah, completely understandable. Our Ben Banks are still offline. And guess what is going to be like that uh, until the next reset? Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm going into or within with 47 mil. Nice. I'm going into it with 80 something mil in assets. That's all of my unsold mog. <laughs> if it's still that high, it might be lower than that now. Depending on what prices I've done, I don't know. It was really high there for a while. <sighs> but I haven't posted in a while, so, you know. And a very positive note for me, the recent buffs to Havoc, specifically the Felsguard Hero Talents, uh, make it look like I can play that one without getting laughed at. Well, that's good. And the Eevee, that is. Gotcha, that makes sense. My hearth isn't forbidden, then I use the portal thing. Noise, noise. Very cool. There we go. Thought I was rich at 6 million. <laughs> yes! Uh... Global appearance unlocks. Yes, right? Absolutely. There we go. <clears throat> uh, stop selling mog stuff. Yeah, completely understandable. 
It definitely takes a long time to sell Mog, but when you have a lot of it, you slowly get income eventually. If I get lucky, I might make it to two mil before War Within. Aww. Now, I haven't even hit one million gold before, but I have spending problems. <laughs> At least you're aware of it, right? If it's Sloot Mugs, it's your assets. <laughs> nice you did there. No, they're not Sloot Mugs, I don't think. There might be some in there. It's just from Mug from wherever I pick it up from my normal gameplay. Mog, pets, I think there's a couple mounts, and then any materials, but those always sell pretty quick, so. My dainty little 70 76k gold. <laughs> yes. Speaking of slew mogs, you can mog off pants now. That's right! Thank you for reminding me, Rhea. I forgot, you can mog off pants. Cool. That'll be nice, I can actually get rid of the pants under my dresses and not look stupid. Yay! Good. When you finally reach 333k gold, what are you going to do? Not buy a Krogma frog mount? <laughs> right? I did the same thing back in BFA. I feel you. I I still need like two of those. Really? I thought you were done yeah. with all the gold sinks. You told me you were oh, done. Oh, no, no. I'm what? done with the FOMO gold sinks. When I said all gold sinks, I meant all of them. What are you doing? You're lucky you, you can't pull gold out of the bank right now, or I'd make you go buy it. We have almost it's two so million. It's so much. It's so much gold. It's not that much. It's so much gold. We can make it in a heartbeat with a tiny bit of elbow grace. It's so much. It's not that much. <laughs> Swear. I took my niece to, to a small museum. Was so tired afterwards, I passed out for four hours. <laughs> oh, completely understandable. That's a lot of walking. I love blasting one of them, mostly because I didn't know where the NPC is and I never bothered looking it up. Gotcha. All my tunes wearing dresses hide pants because it's cheaper. Nice. Really should start uh, making gold again, but I haven't been able to get any hands on a good TSM setup. Gotcha. I would share mine, but I don't have a TSM setup. I just use whatever the default that comes with the add-on is. Because <laughs> I don't really care too much. I love four hour naps. That is what life is all about. Uh, you and Silver both. Silver definitely uh, can, can slap down a good nap. I can't take naps or I feel ill. And then I don't sleep at that, that night. So... I have to not nap. Even if I'm tired. Do you think we'll get Arsenals in the last week of Remix? I'm losing hope here. I personally don't think so. I haven't thought that they would put one in since the start because they've been absolutely silent and haven't even acknowledged anyone's requests or complaints about the arsenals. So I think that's a hard no. I would love to be wrong, however. I would love to be wrong. Oh, uh, no, no, no. All right, not the bank. No, no, stop. Before the game freezes. Hmm. I just got the frog mount you get from Arden Build the Mushroom Boss. Isn't it cute? I love it. It's so blue and pretty. Well, I tried that, but reposting thousand pieces of Mog is crazy to do by hand. Well, I mean, you would do it by hand even if you had TSM strings. Unless you're talking about, like, trying to reprice all of it yourself. I just let it price it for me. Because it won't automate it for you if that's what you're wanting. Uh, pretty good TSM strings, I think. Nice. I couldn't pass on them, even though they're ground mounts. I love frogs. Same. I love frogs. Uh. I reckon have you ever tried Lord of the Rings online? Because the lore stuff there is amazing. I have not. I had a friend who used to play it. I'm not really interested in it, because to be completely honest, I don't like MMOs. I realize the irony. <laughs> But no. I, I had a friend who used to play it, but it's just not really into it. I play with like one friend. I know, right? I realized the irony. Ah, oh, that Mage Tower weapon, I'm so jelly. That was a hard one, too. Arcane was not enjoyable. <laughs> oh. EQ Monk fan followed your channel. 
EQ Monk fan, thank you so much for the follow. Glad to have you here, and I hope you enjoy your stay. Welcome! Uh, I'll win, is it? Fair! I mean, I enjoy Arcane the spec. I meant, like, the challenge is Arcane. Yeah, it sucked. That, that was rough. I struggled with that one. A lot. I play a lot of MMOs. I have played most of them, but I always play them solo. Uh, just jokes I can imagine. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Almost all of them. I have played a lot of them. I've played Final Fantasy back when that came out for a bit. Again, after it was uh, Realm Reborn. And then a little bit again with Silver recently. I've played ESO. I did like that one. Um, I played Black Desert Online for a bit. I've played Star Wars Online, the previous one. Not the current one. Old Republic. I played that one. Uh, I can't think of any other, but I usually just don't continue them because I'm not really... It, I'm into the RPG. Like, whenever I play an MMORPG, it's for the RPG part. I am very much a solo player. I play for the lore. I play for the story. I don't play to play with other people, which is kind of not the direction an MMO wants you to take, for obvious reasons. So, <laughs> so since WoW was pretty dang solo friendly, to be completely honest, that's why uh, I just kind of stick with WoW. I mean, I love WoW lore anyway, so I don't know that I'd ever have another main MMO, but it's the only one I do any collecting, and that's for sure. Like, I intend to go through all of Final Fantasy with Silver, because she's a big lover of the lore. So I'm going to try that again. Um, Gonna do that eventually for the story, but I don't have any desire to collect in it, so. Same with ESO. If Blizzard lets us. Yeah, if Blizzard lets us, we were gonna do that, but then frickin' Remix happened. Still mad about it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm scared to do it, but I have to do Frost. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely difficult, so good luck. Mostly play alone. Me too, if I'm not playing with Silver, so. I started with Ragnarok online, then WoW, and then aside, and on the side while being hopelessly addicted to WoW, tried a bunch of Asian MMOs and WoW killers, quotation marks. <laughs> yes. Was that a staff? Uh, this one, the one I'm on right now? Or the previous one I was on? Because yes, this is the Discipline Priest staff from the Mage Tower. It's so bright. Yes, if it's this one I'm looking at right now. Yes. Previous one. Okay, I'll have to tell you in a second. Probably yes, because I was on a mage, so. Uh, also, people can be mean in MMOs. Absolutely. I've met a lot of not nice people in MMOs, is for sure. Alright, so he's good. Is it hers? Yeah, that's, uh, PvP, um, Shadowlands PvP weapon. Because you can buy those with honor tokens now, so. Yep, that is a staff, because she's a priest. So you can go buy that with honor token badges, or whatever they're called. Badges of honor. That's it. Didn't think about it. <laughs> yeah, I like MMOs as long as people, as, or as long as they're solo friendly. I don't play with people, but I like knowing that other people are in the game. But if a game requires multiplayer dungeons to progress the main story, that tends to turn me away from it. Yep, that was part of the reason I wasn't too thrilled with Final Fantasy XIV, was because of that. Um, so. Whereas while WoW wants you to do the raids to see the end of the story, you don't technically have to. It's not blocking you from future progress, uh, which is nice. So. You yeah, know. Currently leveling a rogue in Remix. Rogues are boring. I feel that I case. I am not fond of leveling rogues. Uh. Here we go. Rogue is a class I can just never, I can, cannot ever get into. I like rogue at max level. I'm not fond of it leveling. It's really fun to farm old raids with, especially sub, because you have the double shadow step. Spammable uh, blade of fans or whatever it is. Um, so, spammy stuff, speed, 
movement. So there, I really like rogues for old content, for farming old content, but I don't like leveling them. Same with druids. I feel the same about druids. I do not like leveling them, but they're great for old content. So, you know. I have done it. What have you done? I have pruned my name saved list. Really? All except for Ulthas, because I'm still deb debating on turning him, on turning Zare into him. Uh huh. I'm impressed. You and me both. Well, and at the same time, I have also finished finally logging into all of my characters, so we can get back my main account now. Yay! Oh. It's done. What'd you say? You would you like to hear a horrifying number on my main account? Sure. Fifty-eight. What What is that number mean? I have 58 characters on that account. Oh, why do you have so many there? <laughs> Dang. Because I'm a nostalgic person, and I like having main characters in our RP. I see. <laughs> Whether they're background <laughs> or not, I had to actually force myself to put Rahidian Rah somewhere else. Got you. <laughs> and I'm like, resisting the urge to put him on the main account. <laughs> We never play with them in game, though. I know. <laughs> All of our RP is not in game. I know. Uh, but I like having them there. I like seeing them. It's funny. Okay, so we are gonna do exactly what I said earlier. We're gonna take a break, which is perfect because it's almost ad break time, anyways. I need more water. I'm severely thirsty. I want a coffee. And then for the last hour of stream. We can do currency stuff, like we were starting to do yesterday, but then found out, you know, we had to log into other characters because it wasn't rating them for the currency stuff. Now we can get to the currency transfer. So let's change stream title real quick. Let me change the title. Warbands. Let's see. Currency X for we need let's see way too much currency transfer <laughs> Excessive even better. We'll use excessive currency transfer for the titles. So I come up with my titles excess If excessive currency transfer There we go That's what we're gonna do But we'll hang out here in the uh, screen. This is a cool screen, and then we'll uh, we'll do that when I get back. I think the currency issues are only with remix alts. Yeah, that's what I've been hearing. Well, kind of. That's partly why I had to log into all of my characters because I wasn't reading some of my characters. But I think that's more of a general warbands thing, as opposed to just currency. That's how I found out about it. Not reading some of my characters. <laughs> but that's done now. We have logged into all. 200 something whatever active characters across all eight accounts. I have 300 some characters, but I don't know how many are actually level 10 and how many are actually 60 plus. But anyway, we're gonna take a short break. I'm gonna go make me a coffee. I'm gonna go free fill my water, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. And then we're gonna buckle down and get into some currency. So I'll be right back.
Okay, there we go. I would have been back a couple minutes earlier, but my I freaking had a sneeze attack right as I came back. I was like, are you serious? <laughs> hey, gravy. All right. Let's log in and do an excessive amount of currency transfer. Whoa. Yes. Also, welcome back. Hello. Why, well, thank you. We got back at the same time. Look at that. Perfect. Ah. Uh, and uh, I like uh, subtlety most IK's sub. That's pretty much the only rogue I play anymore. I haven't liked Assassin since uh, after Legion. Legion, I loved Assassin. But, alas. I lament old outlaw. Yeah. Legion outlaw. Legion outlaw. Greetings, Shrekker Mom. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Welcome. Alright. <clears throat> We have done the thing, everyone. It took us two days to do it. But we have logged into all characters. And registered everything. So we should be good to go with currency transfer and all that stuff now. No more missing characters. Or characters that aren't working. So let's, uh, do that. Hope you guys are well. Doing fantabulous. Glad to have you here. Welcome. Alright, so no transfers for those. We're just going to transfer pretty much everything. I don't even care if I'm actually going to use it or not. I want everything. I'm just, just going to take everything to my main. Because that's how I roll. How many do I have? Not very many of that. Okay, good. <clears throat> so yeah, that's what we're going to do. <laughs> we wish they would fix the warband bank. They're definitely working on it. I know they've uh, been working on it pretty much non-stop at this point. It's related to cross-realm stuff, I think, because they had to temporarily disable um, cross-realm trading as well, which we've had that for a while. That's not a new feature. So, kind of interesting. <clears throat> Breaking news, NA accounts receiving compensation game time for extended downtime. Really? It wasn't half a day, really? <laughs> that's funny. <clears throat> for 14 hours, that's it? They, they, they wanted to give us game time for that? I mean, alright. I guess I won't complain. Sure. I won't say no, I suppose. A little weird, but I won't say no. <sighs> Meanwhile, I'm running into issue of character stuck in steady flight. Oh no! I'm sorry. That's not fun. That's not fun at all. Uh, I'm trying to buy recipes on my crafters. A war bank would be so helpful doing this. Yeah, soon. Soon. I know I want to do some uh, guild stuff, but the guild bank isn't working very well either, so... Because of the cross realm stuff. They're they're working on it. It's one day of extra game time. <laughs> well I mean, to be fair, that's about all that we even lost anyways, so Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised they were given any at all. You and me both. There you go, one extra day, everybody who don't know who wanted it. <laughs> uh <clears throat> uh. Ella, let's see, where are we at here? Well, myself to setting up TSA and resuscitating my old speed set druid. Nice, good luck. Your elemental overflow is stuck at 195k. I don't believe so. Let me change it to update it. Nope, it appears I am at 245,000. You have to f switch the tabs for it to update visually. It's there. It's just um, not updating live. But it'll be here in your 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 transfer currency list too. This will be accurate. <clears throat> Excuse me. Right, going to try to level a drac. Uh, now, Dev or Og. I am a proponent of uh, devastation. I like my devos. They are very enjoyable. Very enjoyable indeed. Go. Give me all your stuff. 
Give me all your things. All of your stuff and things. Oh, Druid flight form with dragon flying made me motion sick as hell. <laughs> really? <laughs> I'd rather 2.5 mil tab for war bank, thanks. Yeah, understandable. I found a formal dengue on the auction house in my lesser played realm, bought it for 700k. Nice! Congrats! I don't remember what I paid for mine. It was more than that, though, that's for sure. Uh, well, yay, an extra day when I pay for a sub yearly sub anyway. I'd rather they fix more banks and make the tabs cheaper. <laughs> exactly! Uh, it satisfies the people who were complaining about losing 14 hours of game time, so... It's fine. It appeases the masses. As they say. Let's see, got that one, got that one, we're good with that one already, we're good with that one. Okay, so Dragonflight's done. Right, we need to finish. Ah, we can finally finish. There we go, look how many more are actually there. There was not a lot of characters being read. Mm hmm. I have a whole list. Beautiful. Whole list. Because that worked out yesterday and there there wasn't any left. But now, there's a whole bunch! So definitely, if y'all were questioning it, absolutely log into all of your characters. Because... I didn't read all of them. Beautiful. Oh, to be fair, East Coast people who had left for work in the morning and the game wasn't up till midnight for many of whom had probably gone to bed by then. Even West Coast people do sleep around 8 to 9 p.m. So lots of people did actually lose a full game, day of gameplay. They did indeed. Which is why I said, you know, it makes sense. Ah, uh, great. I was worried we you were losing it all. No, I'm not losing any of it. Don't worry. The only currency issue stuff uh, besides characters not being read to pull from that I've been hearing about is specifically related to Remix. Which we are not uh, getting anything from Remix characters, so. <clears throat> Aug is getting changed and we're within so I don't get too attached. True, that makes sense. I just plan to not play on patch days, but I get it, I guess. Yeah, same. I don't expect at all to play on patch days. <laughs> I come predisposed to knowing you cannot really play on a patch day. And if you do, everything's borked. It's normal. But to the new folks, I suppose, that don't know that, now they do. New mob's not giving you any uh, loot in raids anymore. I'm not sure. I've been not been in a raid since patch dropped. This is all I've been doing right here. <laughs> uh. Uh, I know it's been said, but your team mods are also great. Thank you, Ivish. That's uh, that's sweet of you. I love transmog. Even though I definitely feel like WoW transmog is a little limited, I really enjoy transmogging. So I hope someday we'll get more. It's only gonna be more fun to farm. That's for sure. Last Legion raid I have left, aside from Elfar Wings and Taurus. And Taurus is awesome, I hope. Well, you sound like you're not enjoying it, but I hope you enjoy it anyways. Uh, I'm in Devoker for a bit. Dev is easier to understand. Yeah, Devastation is definitely simpler. I do really enjoy it a lot more than the other two. I think the Vlutuk is protesting it didn't get sky riding. Second character now where I switch from sky riding to the steady flight. And I have the blue Vlutuk whenever I push off random fave mount button and he doesn't go away even if I switch back and forth. <laughs> oh no! He probably is protesting. I get it. He was the only one left out. Rude. Did normal vault, it works fine? Good. Glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. Uh, Ogon Zandalari Empire QM uh, has two mounts for 82k gold combined. Not to grind more gold. Nice, get that gold. Got this. Whoops, did I smack <clears throat> my mic? I'm sorry. And we're still going on time warped badges. I know. I think it was you, Witch Hobbit, who said yesterday you wanted to see how much 
I was gonna have total. I'm up to 128,000 so far. Um, and now that it's probably reading all of my characters, because this is where we had to stop, um, I can actually get the rest of them. Uh, almost done. Almost done. Just a few left. Almost done. Yep, last one. Alright, let's refresh that. There it is. So my, my end total is 128,419. 128k. Time warp batches. That's less than I thought I would have, but still a lot more than I did have. <laughs> That's a lot. You had 600k-ish? Wow. Yeah, I don't farm uh, time walking much anymore, just because I bought all the stuff a long time ago, so, you know. Even more of a degen than my 96k time warp badges. Thanks for making me feel like an old person cracking. You're welcome. I think a lot of that is from... Uh, the anniversary event, because you know how when the anniversary comes around, you log in and it sends you 200 time warp badges on each character? Well, I would purposely do that over the years. I don't know that they'll do that anymore now that it's a current wide count, count wide currency, but I think that's where a lot of that was coming from. Uh, so, one, what, go ahead. Does it mean I can coerce you into buying the recipes for me? They're BOP. Are they BOP? I think they can sell them. Pretty sure. You can, you can buy them off the auction house. They're usually expensive. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Well, I'll give you a strong maybe, because I have a lot of rep to buy, but if I have stuff left after that, yes. So how about them apples? I actually need to buy the recipes for myself, too. <laughs> I don't have them either. <laughs> I thought you did. <laughs> well, I probably do on some characters, but remember I was redoing my professions, but I never finished it. Mm, so right. I never got around to uh, completing that. Mm -hmm. Are you doubling the professions again, or...? Uh, no. Maybe. I haven't done research on it. I need to look and see just how many, like, Horde Alliance-specific stuff there is, but I think it's only with, like, leatherworking and stuff. And, like, blacksmithing and tailoring the armor. But mm -hmm. even then, I'm not too worried about it, because I think a lot of that is BOE. Not yeah, the recipe it itself, but the item when you craft it. Mm -hmm. So I wasn't too worried. So I don't know. I don't have all the answers for that one yet. Fair enough. I haven't thought about professions in a while, to be honest. I, <laughs> I haven't either. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, I need to restore a few tunes that have 10k plus. Yeah, you definitely should. I mean, you can't now. Not for a while until they bring uh, character restoration back, but but yes, indeedy. Let's see if Mythic Anar is still annoying to solo. Probably. I haven't heard of any changes. Uh, given Dark Moon Prize tickets are uh, warbound now, it'd be much easier to get one can one character if you just do the hundred tickets, quest line of ten characters, and send it over, right? Yes. Yes, indeed. And I would do that before Blizzard decides otherwise. That would be my recommendation to you. If you need to see how to do all that, I do have a DMF video to get you about like 190 per character or whatever it was. Um, so. I'll be watching it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, think I, I think I've only done that quest on like maybe a handful of characters. Yeah. Like, not even ten. At least, maybe five. Yeah, that particular one, the, the Rolo or whatever it's called, is a, a one-time quest. Silas. It's Silas. Rolo yeah. is Yeah, a Silas one. is. Silas is a secret something. Secret stash, I think. Yeah, Silas is a secret stash. It is a one-time forever per character. It's not once per dark one fair, it's one time permanently. So that's why I have that tracked in my spreadsheets. In our spreadsheets, actually. Yeah, I... Uh need to do it when it comes around next time. Yep. Well, it's uh, like soonish. see, on the 4th, it looks like it should be back. I should have time. So, yeah. <clears throat> we'll see. 
Yes, I used that video earlier this month to get the Dark Moon talk on the Dark Moon Zeppelin pets. <laughs> Perfect! Our Dark Moon tickets one to one conversion? Seems to be. It's not telling me about any loss, because it will tell you if there's a loss, which is nice. So I don't see any. So I think so. Let's see. I currently have 695. It wants to give me 5. I take five. I have 700. Yes, it is one to one. Confirmed. But yeah, it should tell you if there's a uh, a loss. It'll warn you, like, hey, this is a. You'll lose 30% or whatever. Which is gross, but there's not very many that have a loss. There was really only like a couple, which is kind of weird. But, you know. It all should be one to one. Agreed. It should be. It's it's your characters. <laughs> it's not like you're getting it from other people. Agreed. But luckily, there's not many. There's only a couple that are. I think it was a couple of the weird Shadowlands ones. Um, we can look at those right now. Was Cosmic Flux one of them? Mm -hmm. I think so. Uh, BFA War Resources as well. Uh, it's not telling me, actually. One, two, three. Yeah! They removed the warning. It's supposed to tell you. Alright, well, it doesn't warn you anymore. Blizzard has made me a liar. So. There you go. It doesn't tell you anymore. That's unfortunate. Oh, Flux has attacks. Yeah, there's just a couple of them. Like, BFA, uh, Silver said BFA resources. Flux is one. It's like, when I looked at the list from Beta, it was just enough to barely count on one hand. Like, there wasn't that many. So I don't think we need to worry too much, to be honest. There's a lot of the stuff where it's like, am I ever going to use this? <laughs> so. And I'm technically as a tax since you can't send over amounts less than 1,000. Yeah, but that's not part of the cur transfer currency system either. They didn't add it. They were going to. <clears throat> but I guess they decided not to, so. That's... That hasn't changed. That's still, uh, you have to buy it from the, uh... Convert it, I guess, from the, uh, flight vendor guy. Anima, let's see that. Is the Dark Moon Zeppelin 1k tickets? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Typical Blizzard, right. Uh, I got a message saying it wasn't one to one. Interesting. I wonder if it's, uh, so I have something suppressing it. It's supposed to tell you. It's supposed to probably be like, hey, this is a, a X loss. Do you want to do this? At least it did. So, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe it's not working. Uh,. Why can't I lock my XP oh. game? I think you have to be level 59 or lower, I think is the level. I don't know. <clears throat> I know you can't do it uh, in the in the max level range, I know that much. It's a little icon that it pops up. I think you screenshot what it looks like. Show thing, there we go. Why is it not showing you that? Mine doesn't have that. Ah! It's because ATT is taking over it and it's at the bottom. I'm out, lost, and transferred. That is not easy to see. Down there at the very bottom of my, my tooltip. But that's still not... What are you using that's showing that? I guess because uh, I you don't use LVI. <clears throat> no, you know, probably I don't use LVIs. LVI must be suppressing it. Because mm. mm. I don't have that um, amount loss percentage either. Yeah, so it's. I think LVI is suppressing it and ATT is making up for it and telling me in its tooltip. I don't know. Whatever. Mm. All I know it was it was all the currencies I didn't care about. So that's all. so I wrote off the list. I don't know what the list is. I have been bamboozled. 
<laughs> Bamboozled. Uh, run default. Nice. Very nice, very nice. Don't forget for DMF tickets, there is one old tier 0.5 recolor mod you can buy there. You can indeed, which I ironically, I semi recently, last year sometime, had just done that. That's why I made um, that video on Silas's, because I, I had. That's what I was using it for. So, kind of funny. How many of these do I have left? Quite a few. Alright. Let's get all this currency. La 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 la. Well, I'll have plenty for whenever they bring new buyable stuff to Darkwood Fair, so I'm cool with that. Cool beans. Uh, is currency transfer working? Are you wasting your currency? It is working indeed. The only currency that it wasn't working with was remix stuff. Because I don't think we're supposed to be able to transfer between remix characters. <laughs> so. That's the only time I've seen it. But mine seems to be working just fine, so. Uh, what are we at here? Which is screaming to the void? I'm sorry, Flop. I know. Did y'all say, confirm what, what level it was? Is it 51? That you can't, you, ha you can't, uh... 60 plus, you can't uh, lock your XP. Is it still 59 and lower? I never lock my XP because I don't do that anymore, so I, I have no idea what it is now. Uh, does anyone know if Timeless Isle Frogs drop bronze? Uh, can they drop green weapons? I don't know, honestly. I didn't farm uh, Timeless for Mog. I was there long enough to get the rep and then left. I did all of my weapon mug farming over on Isle of Thunder, because there was less people there. Hmm. I know the Ordos guys do. Around uh, Jacker and Osu. I don't know what will happen to Dark Moon quest items since I don't think Blizzard planned the tickets to be this easy to get. I don't know. That is quite- that is curious. We'll find out. They clearly consciously decided to put this one on the list because they handpicked all of these currencies. There is a lot they left out on purpose, so they must have decided it was fine. It's probably going to be, um, account locked. You can oh. only do it on one character on your entire- entire battle net. I can see that. Guess we'll find out, eh? Uh, how do you link your outfit again? Uh, uh, I don't know, actually. I don't remember. <laughs> I haven't done that in a while. I'm not sure. Liking Drac a lot more than Rogue. Drac there? So, Evoker? Nice. Evoker's awesome. Speaking of, of Drac there, I'm very excited we're getting more classes soon. Please, I want to make more drag there. Oh, yeah, I find it odd anima isn't a transferable currency. Yeah, not like this. Like, you can technically transfer it, but I would love to do this with it because I have a lot of less than 1k anima just sitting there across all of these alts I'm never going to use. I'm not going to go farm to get it up to 1k because that's a waste of time. So it's just going to sit there and rot. Pun intended. There we go. If you want to farm timeless weapons, Mog is a nice spot on the Isle of Thunder. The Hyper spawns the Alliance Portal Channelers. Gives a lot of threads and items which are vulnerable to open world PvP. Nice. Good to know. Maybe they want to cut down the insane tour that is Darkmoon Fair. <laughs> Fair. Fix itself. It still went down by 3%. Aww. You can farm it on Isle of Thunder because it has the same loot table as Timeless Isles and Isle of Giants. Indeed, you can indeed. That's what Silver and I did. Cause black. Mm. Black. Timeless was way too populated. Hmm. Alright. 
How many of these we have left? A lot. Okie dokie. We press on. <laughs> like I said in the title, excessive currency transfer. <sighs> but I'm that person and I want it all on this character, so... I want it! Oh, it sounds like a good farm for Mog these days. Well, what's a good farm? Can't go wrong with ZF. If you're looking to sell, I don't know. <laughs> I don't have a good answer. Uh, I don't usually farm Mog to sell. I did for a very brief period and got extremely bored, so I gave up. And that was like back in BFA. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, less populated right now, but part of the reason I do this is for the daily boxes, Rathian Rip, and Timeless Coins. Gotcha, that makes sense. Well, I'd recommend, I would say, uh, if you want to be on Timeless, I know the Ordos guys up around uh, Jacker and Osu were pretty good. That's where Silver and I farmed our rep. And the elites there aren't nearly as hard hitting as like the bigger Ordon Ordos dudes. So, maybe try that area. Personally, I think there are better ways to make gold too. Fair. That is fair. <laughs> it's fun to farm Mog. It's just... Not fun to sell it. Which is unfortunate. They're almost done with Dark Moon Fair tickets. Beautiful. Looks like I'll have uh, almost 1200. Yep, that's all done. Nice. So I have 1,148. 1,148. 1.1k tickets. Very nice. Uh, Riders of Azeroth badge? Really? We can do those? Hm. I mean, I only have a couple on other characters, but sure. Why not? Alright, Traders Tender. Obviously. <laughs> it's already a warband currency. But that is kind of nice. They say there's warband transferable and warband currency. So, because we're Traders Tender, we know it's just, it's just a camp wide. You know, the thing I wish they did with all of them. Anyway, that one's done. Let's see. PvP. Nope. And whoever said you could transfer honor was a liar! You cannot transfer honor. I tried. No option. Can't do Tolbarad. That's a bummer. Alright, Shadowlands. Let's see. Catalogued research. Good thing I don't have any. Some other characters. Cosmic Flux. Okay, honest question. Does anyone even know what Cosmic Flux is used for anymore now that the, uh... Um... What the balls is that thing called? Creation Catalyst doesn't use it anymore? Like, is it used for anything else other than that? You can transfer honor through the Vendor Veil Dragon, but you do lose honor when you do. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Nope, I have so much of it. <laughs> Got you. Not even bothering with it at the moment. Fair, completely fair. You could transfer honor the first night. Thought about dumping it on an alt. Really should have. Ah, it must have been unintended. Well, 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 Blizzard. Hmm. Uh, did you need Cosmic Flux to make the legendary stuff? Do you? I thought that was um, Soul Cinders and Soul Ash. Are those not the ones used to make the legendaries? Or do you need Cosmic Flux too? I haven't made the SLA goes in a while, so I don't remember. I only ever made like two of them, and they were for myself. <laughs> Each two had a different reagent. Okay, that must be what they're for then. Um, I do want to craft those at some point. Is there a loss on that? Does that have a loss? It's not showing me. Yes. Okay, I won't transfer Cosmic Flux then. I'll wait in case I do need it, because I do need to get, I think, some of that crafting done on some of my alts. So I'll figure that out at a later date. Cypher's the first one. You can transfer Cypher's the first one now. Cool. Anyway. <laughs> 
I'm gonna transfer all my ciphers now, now that I don't need them. I'm not salty. It's okay. This will be nice for new people. Uh, on the other hand, I could be talking out of my ass. It's been two years, so I forgot how stuff works. Too many Blizzard systems to keep track of. That's why I was asking you guys, because it's the same thing for me. I'm like, ah, uh, it's okay. I'll leave it where it is. There's a transfer loss on it anyway. Um, I, that can just, it's fine. <laughs> it can just stay there. I don't need it. Uh, not sure if it was said, but I'm very impressed with how enlightened they were about having currency is transferable on the character you're currently on. Same! Right? It's very nice. I'm very happy with that because like I thought I would have to like get on each character and transfer that way. Like how tedious. But here I could just take it from him. Like I still wish it was just straight up account wide. I don't know why I need to go through these extra steps. But they really want me to so I will. New expansion comes out, new system to learn. Well, there goes the memories from third grade getting pushed out to make room for new stuff. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, someone understands it, man. Uh, yeah, I thought we had to log into all of them. Same. I didn't mess with this on beta, so like I only saw other people do it. And so I I'm pleased that that is not the case. Because how tedious that would be. Uh, they also need to make the window not close after the transfer. Agreed. That that would be nice. Just leave it up. Also, wish enter worked for confirm. Same. I keep trying to hit enter because I'm typing on my T9 on the side. And it's just, it's not, it, it the enter no worky. I have to clicky. Like, please, let me let me use my years of data entry experience to, to do this currency transfer thing. Oh well. I assume the same thing. Imagine Blizz making things not tedious on purpose before people even complain. <laughs> That's not how it works, though. We have to complain first. You know that. Come on. They like the complaints. <laughs> That's how they, it's how they get their attention. We're in a toxic relationship with Blizzard. Come on. I I pay for this game. They abuse me a little bit. I keep paying for it. I get abused a little more. It's mutual, you know? Uh, the enter worked for me. It just doesn't highlight. Uh, yeah, you can put it in, but it, like, it won't like finish the transaction. It just it won't continue. So I don't know. Uh, hello, you don't have to put all the exact number, put 9 and 9 and it takes all. Correct indeed, but I use a T9 and I'm very good at uh, data transfer. I have to think about it if I'm just hitting one button. So, it's easier for me to just put in the exact number. But that is a nice feature. I'm very glad that they did that. So. Uh, for me, her be it, uh, for me to judge a humiliation kink from Blizzard. <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. Maybe they, maybe they have a humiliation cake. <laughs> I can see it. I can see it. You, yeah, you think so? Based on the fact that uh, they make some really weird decisions if they're trolling us, right? Sometimes I wonder. Like I love y'all, but are you trolling me right now? You know? Sometimes I wonder. Let's see. All right, so ciphers are done. Grateful offerings. Oh, it opened all up again. All right, grateful offerings. I think those are done. Yes, we did those yesterday. So that's good. So it did actually read all the characters on this, that one yesterday, but not the other ones? That's so weird. Far be it for me to judge me. Oh, it's everything. Uh, trial of style next week. Ooh, nice. Speaking of, didn't they say they were going to make the Trial of Style tokens Warbound? Because they're still Soulbound. That was something I was looking forward to. Oh well. So for Anima, Fragments, Soul Ash. Is there a loss with that? 17%. Yeah, I don't need that. Cinders. 
Stygia. You can't transfer Stygia? Oh, that sucks. Ember and Tower Knowledge. Alright, so uh, Shadowlands is done. I mean, Blizzard is also home to whoever it was that was drinking poop milk that kept uh, in the employee fridge, so I'm sure there's some weird shit put in the game because of kinks. That is fair. That is completely fair. Ah, oh, the joys of working uh, with uh, a large company. I've had my share, a fair share of experiences of similar stuff. It's just great. Seafair is doubloon. You can transfer doubloons. Neat. We just finished that. That's we did, and I have 15,000. You have 15,000? <laughs> you need to spend that shit, my dude. I do. I my do girl? It. Yeah. Do you I mean, want to wait until we can access the guild bank? Yeah, wait till we can access the warband banks and the guild bank and that that's all working. Okay. Wait till that's finished because a lot so of that say. gets dumped in the guild. In the guild. I'm not doing auction house stuff right now because I can't access the guild, so... 15,000. Insanity. That is insane. Yep, and our still sucks. Went out on the wrong side of the ship and wiped. Oh no! Rip. Thank you for reminding me. You're welcome. Blizzard, why? Right. 15k? I would love that. Right? I'm just happy the BFA 7th Legion or whatever currency is transferable. It is! My only complaint? Ech. Stop untrying. Is it's uh, faction specific. So, like, the Horde and Alliance ones, you can't share them. They don't convert, apparently. Luckily, I have a Horde main as well, who we will also be looking at. Um, but... Yeah. Dibloons, that's what I was doing. Uh, 32... Uh, the thank you was about the, the poop milk got you. Yeah, that was doing Shadowlands. I think it's kind of funny. Everyone knocks on uh, Shadowlands itself for being the reason the game wasn't doing so hot, but I think it was uh, coupled with all the drama that was going on. It wasn't just the game. So, funny that. Uh, Blizzard, one of the oldest video game companies in the market, valued in billions, won countless awards for their myriad of games, brought hundreds of millions of people together. Uh, over the years, literally causing babies to be made and families to be formed. Yeah, I know lots of people who've gotten married through the game. It goes down as the company where weirdos steal a drink breast milk. <laughs> uh, that's the joy when you have thousands and thousands of his employees. You're unfortunately gonna get some weirdos. <laughs> oh, isn't that just the sad reality, though? Definitely, right? And COVID. Yep, that too. I saw people complain about DF somehow. I mean, I definitely have some complaints about DF, so I would be one of them, Septia. I would de I would definitely be one of them. But, DF is now behind us, so... We can only go up from here, right? Right? Fingers crossed. It's okay, Daddy Metzen's back. He's gonna save us all. Isn't that what they say? Don't jinx it. <laughs> I'm in my X three WoW back in Wrath. I literally have a WoW baby. Well, there you go. Look at that. Don't put that energy into the universe. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, I'll be here, rain or shine. That's uh, what WoW players do. We play the game and we complain. Exactly! <laughs> you, you nailed it, Miranda. You nailed it. Only old god energy here. <laughs> yes! How many more of these do I have? Oh. A lot. Alright. Still going. Still going. That's fine. Uh, I met my wife and Mop. We took a while break, but we still play. Aw, oh, that's cute. Love to hear it. On WoW. Perfect. Look at that. Uh, I know I met uh, Silver in in uh, with because of Wow. So that's fun. Legion twenty seventeen. Yep. 
2018. One of the two. 17. Was it 17 or 17? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Yeah, because it was uh, Nighthold. That's when we met. Uh, uh, Nighthold. <laughs> Love that raid, but our guild was garbage. Oh, it was more than garbage. I was being nice. Republic. <laughs> I'm not. I have very not nice words to say about that guild, but we are currently alive, so. Very true, very true. <laughs> I don't do kids, but I did meet my dog's uh, mom's owner on WoW. Oh, that's cool. I was too scared of people in WoW to get a relationship with someone unfair. <laughs> no kidding. Oh, Legion, how I miss you so. You and me both. I love Legion. Imagine if we had all of the fun quality of life and great systems we have now, and then Legion happened. Ugh. Talk about and they the... didn't change the talents. And they didn't change the talents. We kept all Legion stuff. Please. Ah. I beg. What an idyllic world that would have been. Yep. I only ever had men being weird and whispering to me just because I play a female elf, right? Oh, I feel that. Mage Tower, my beloved. Right. If only the Mage Tower was what it was back then. I don't like this new uh, scaled version. It sucks. Uh, were you talking about the FedEx military guy yesterday or was it someone else? I think that was someone else. It might have been Brielle. I don't remember. I have so many of you to keep track. Was it Brielle? Okay. Yeah, it was Brielle. I love all of you, I promise. But I do get your stories crossed. I have so many children. And not enough arms to hold them. <laughs> I consider you all of all my little cracklets. So, you know. Even though most of you are probably older than me. <laughs> but we're old gods. I mean, it's, weird stuff happens. Ah, uh, good coffee. Any more I got? Quite a few. Okay. Huh. Mama, don't love us. Don't love you? Why, why don't you want me to love you? What? <laughs> oh, yeah. Surprising since stories about women getting harassed are online are so rare, right? Right? No kidding. I have multiple of my own, so it's like... Ugh. Oh. Not surprising. Oh, that was a nine. That's a nine. We're in the single digits now. All the single digits. My shoulder is itchy. Eh. Here we go. Do, 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 do. This is really boring, but that's okay because I want my stuff. La 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 la. The joy is when you have a lot of characters. This is this is one of the downsides, but also an upside. So it depends on how you look at it. <laughs> The maintenance is long, but the loot is lots. So it's good. The Warband minigame. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's definitely rare now and well for me, at least. It is. Same for me. I I've not had nearly as many issues. Granted, I don't raid anymore. So that definitely helps. But. Bright side, you only need to do that once. Exactly. I and it's, it's very minimal after that. And I'll know, like, if I get it on alts in the future, I can just immediately transfer it. This is just the the front-loaded work, you know? So, exactly. Oh, uh, we're getting down there, I think. Yep, just a few left. Nice. You'll have way more doubloons than me, but I spent all, a lot of mine, so... Yep, that's it. Yeah, I have, uh... Stop doing that. 2,474, so 2,400 doubloons. You have a lot more than me, that's for sure. Let's see, and that's a 24% loss rate, ouch. Luckily I don't need more resources for like anything. 
All right, Battle for Azeroth is done. I mostly play female characters, and for years I had some dude stalking me. I made a priest in siege, and apparently healed a group with this dude, but then I quit my priest and moved back to my rogue. For like the next three or four expansions, when I'd randomly log into my priest for some reason, the student instant messaged me. It was weird. I wouldn't even respond, but he kept messaging me over the years. Weird. What a weirdo. And a curious coin. I guess I could transfer all of these. Is there a loss? No. Alright. Let's transfer curious coins. Here we go! I don't know what I'll use them for. But I got him. Do 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 do. Ah, uh, all of them thirsty dudes assume you're female because your tune is female, which is funny, because I feel like a lot of dudes play female characters. So it's like, what? Wait. <laughs> so it's just guys hitting on other guys. That's funny. The new update reset my pristine leads and artifacts achievement. I only needed one more. Oh no! <laughs> I have oh, been no. hearing that of people's. Uh, the update keeps like resetting people's um, in progress achievements that they had, and I'm so glad I didn't have any like that. Uh, that's also why I hardcore wanted to finish before pre patch. So I am no. Sorry. <laughs> What? Did no, yours do it too? I reset mine too! Ha ha! I needed three! Ha ha! I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just being mean because it's you! Uh. Personally, I just assume everyone would come, come across and wow our dudes and let's prove it otherwise. Same, honestly. A girl, guy in real life. <laughs> exactly. I'm sorry, that's over. But were to be fair though, were you actively working on on that? Yeah. You were? You've been on every day working on that? No. Okay, with that. It's not transferring from Grek. Stop this. I've already been on this character. It was only the Legion creator though. That reset. Why just Legion? I don't know. The Drainer one is it's still filled out. <laughs> That's Whatever. Good. It's fine, I guess. <sighs> I'm sorry. I exclusively play female characters as a guy. I like to have something to look at. I play male characters for pretty much the same reason. So, cannot log into a character to update process. Wait, what? You cannot log into in until the up character update process you recently initiated is complete. I have a character update process that I initiated. What's that mean? means I think I have that too on a couple um, on a handful actually I think it's for the currency huh. well, all right let me reload the game here I just noticed my it reset my treasures with all dress achievement but you can only get the treasures once per character so I don't need to do it on a different character now <laughs> oh lovely that's fun I find most female blood elf uh, players. Oh, it's in the way. Uh, where's that? Our men and prob down to not being allowed to play with Barbies when we were kids. I am guilty as charged. <laughs> That's funny, to be honest. Okay, let's try logging into him again. We're logging into a different character. Uh. I just came here. Hello, hi everyone. Hello, Lord Dagda. How you doing? Glad to have you here. Welcome. Got Anar done on second try. Warped back. Yeah, okay. That's right over here. I warped back under the ship. Fight ended, and the ship despawned under my feet. I fell to my death. Oh no! <laughs> Rip. Rip arena. Uh, I was playing my female night elf priest who was wearing the summer mog in the trading post and I had this weirdo keep whispering me the other day. That is weird. Uh, I just report him and ignore him. Alright. Hello, fellow pink hair. Uh, hello. Look at that. I'm you, but short. <laughs> and female. And female. Look at that.
at that. That's cute. That is cute. Alright. Uh, let's see here. Try to get back on him. If it doesn't let me, that's fine. Well, uh, they we're kind of at the end of the stream here anyways. Hmm. Yep, okay. That's fine. Well, that's fine. We'll let that finish its thing. It's a little corn fused now. I think I stressed it out with all the currency I was transferring, which is a lot. So. Yeah. But we'll call it there. I think we're good for the day. We. Why is where did my music go? I think the music broke. Music? There it goes. It's like, oh, 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 that's my cue. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh. Alright, anyway. I'll be back next Monday. We are at the end of stream. If you'd like to see my schedule, there's my schedule, my normal time. It is Thursday, which means I will not be back tomorrow. Not until Monday, because I don't stream on the weekends. Too much family time. So, you all have a fantastic evening. I'll be back in a few days, and I will see you later. Good luck with the Warband stuff, and hopefully the Warband bank will be fixed by Monday, because if it is, we can do that. But have a good night. Love all of you. Hugs and kisses, and good night. Bye! <laughs>